Welcome everyone to the 118th One Planet, One Nation, One Race for World Peace. It's Tuesday, May 19th, 2020. This is a broadcast of the Keshe Foundation Spaceship Institute Educational Department and part of the public teachings in English. My name is Rick Kramen. I'll be your host today, along with uh, Carolina Keshe of the Keshe Foundation. I believe she's ready to begin today's. Uh, uh, actually, she's not in today's workshop. So, oh, there she is. Hi, good morning, Rick. Hi, good Caroline. Morning. Good evening. Welcome, everybody, to the platform of the One Planet, One Race, One Nation. I think uh, Jamila, Jamila has your program ready. I send you a notice that you picked it up, Rick. Yes, I've got that. So do okay. you want me to play it? Um, or would she play it? You're going to have to start with Jamila. You can switch over to Jamila. She has the planning. OK. Um, I think we'll have to bring her in as a panelist then. Okay, I'll promote her to panelist. Is she the only one in uh, presenting in the presentation? Hi, Rick. Hi, everyone. Hi, Caroline. Hi, Jamila. Um, do you need anybody else in as a panelist to be part of the presentation that will actually be showing anything or do I have to unmute anyone? So the Universal Council, uh, we are all presenting together today. Okay. So, okay, if, if anybody yeah. reads anything, they will have to be unmuted in order to read. So just let me know who's reading and then I'll have to unmute them. So Depending you want? On. Do you want one by one, or you br you bring them on the panel and uh, they know which part they have to to come to read? Well, we don't have people in as panelists now. We have we, we open their microphone instead of bringing people in as panelists. So I'm not sure how to do that. Um, because from we organize from our side when we see the presentation we know who is going but if you don't have it uh, and you don't see people here you don't see the participants and I, I will have to put them into panelists i guess so give me the yeah. list and we'll just promote them to panelists now so you have almost every all the so caroline priller for example, so just uh, let me just uh, tell you, um, Caroline Piller, Joachim, Pete, Mosfek, Dr. Dr. Gatwa, Pia, Showeta, Emmanuel. Okay, Gatwa's guys too, so who is after Gatwa, sorry? Yeah, Dr. Gatwa, Pia. Got Gatwa, mm -hmm. Yeah. Jam Pia. Jamila, Dr. Gatwa and uh, Caroline Pearl, they just did a presentation last week. No, 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 it's okay, it's for the global one. It's for the global presentation. Yeah, so then, um, yeah, I said Pia, Peter, Pete. Pia. Pete? Pia. Yeah, Pia. Okay. Pete. Okay. Shueta. Emmanuel. Uh, who was it after Shueta? Emmanuel. Okay. Marie, Ursula, Azar, I, I, hear, I heard you, Azar, uh, Stefania, Ketan as well. 
Um, Ursula, uh, Stefania. Azar, Kitan. You have Marie, you have already, I, I think. So I'm not sure if I got everybody. You can have a look at the list there. It's yeah. hard to hit them because they yeah, bounce so I, around so much. Okay, so I, I check here. So we have uh, Azar, Caroline, uh, Mosfek, Pia, Pete, uh, Shueta, Stefania, Ursula, and uh, um, Ketan. If you can add Ketan. Okay. Yeah, Mosfek. Marie. Okay, I think we have those. Mm -hmm. so almost like okay, I should be at them. Is it possible to turn off the music in the background? Or is that just? Uh... It's me. It's myself. I think. Yeah. 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 Sorry. Yes. Now, are you going to do the presentation, or shall I? I you, got it. I I send it to you, so. Yeah, okay, I'll play it then, if you like. Yeah, and did you receive uh, the video I sent also to you? Video. Yeah. Can I sent it to you as well. If you want it outside, you have to bring it in. Okay, just a minute. And uh, we are missing also Carolina here. I heard her speaking, but. Uh... Yeah, it's because of the new format. Okay, I'm, yeah, I'm still it, trying to get the, the video to open up here. I'm not finding it, so just a minute. Is the video? I see. Where's the other one? Okay. Okay. Now I understand. I thought the video was the presentation. Yes, it is part. It will come. Uh, you will see the slide for that. And uh, by the way, yeah. we are missing here Kitan and. Oh, Ursula is there. So, Ketan. Pete. Are you there? Yeah, you, you are there, Pete. Yeah. Joachim, is Joachim there? Yes. Yes, okay. I think from our side, we are here.
Hello everyone to our Universal Council presentation today. Okay, are you ready to begin? Yes, we are ready. My name is Caroline, I'm UC German, and I'll uh, present you the first slides. What is our one nation global guidance one planet one nation one race with all of us united together as one nation one planet one race we work together through our souls and our unity manifests the solutions in matter state. Now, the introduction. The Universal Council is to be the bridge between humanity and the universal community. The universal community will be the contact point for all humans and other beings traveling in space or beings visiting planet Earth. The universal council is responsible for interaction with the universal community. For example, conditions, interface, visitors, for those already here. The Universal Council will decide how to share on Earth new technologies offered by the Universal Community by providing open source solutions that benefit all. Joaquim Ferrari e o C Portuguese. Guiding principles. The Universal Council guarantees that souls who and which live or live on this planet will obey the rules of peaceful coexistence on Earth and beyond. And the only course from this point on for all souls is to be in peace and in harmony at all times. This council is and will be the true reflection of the whole of humanity on earth and in space. Hi, it's uh, Peter Chemek, UC Polish. So the vision, the responsibility of the Universal Council is to guarantee that each language on earth and those of other essences of creation and from other positions in the universe which reside on earth are represented as one 
Universal Council member. And all languages have the same rights, equal responsibility, value, and position in the Council. Each member represents the needs and wishes of the people and entities who speak their native language, regardless of their geographical circumstances. Members of the Universal Council are here to support mankind and others on Earth and beyond to facilitate a peaceful and prosperous future for the human race and others for harmonious coexistence on Earth and within the Universal Community. Thank you. This is Maswek representing Universal Council Bengali language. The Universal Council's activities from global policies to strategy to implementation are uh, held in place on top of five pillars. And these pillars are soul, ethos, unity, service, and peace. The soul of Universal Council invites every soul to the Charter for Humanity to serve with love and peace for all creations of the Creator. The ethos, we are here to serve, not to be served with wisdom, equality, integrity, and humbleness, unity. The expression of this essence is the unity of all beings in the path of serving all unconditionally. Service. The Universal Council is here to serve each and every soul in the universe with unconditional love to bring unity to all beings. Peace. Peace is a natural state of all human beings and with elevation of all souls, we bring humanity to this natural state. This is Gatwa representing the Gekoyo community, the Gekoyo language. Global policies, number one. Universal Council policies and their execution. Setting up and integrating procedures, team logistics, achieving fair and balanced global coordination structure. Two, protection of beings and global peace. Justice for all beings with protection, equality for all lives, no borders, signing of World Peace Treaty. Number three, relations and communications. Relations and communications are established peacefully through the presence and interactions of the UC languages and their supporters, guiding the communities with a new ethos, living in harmony, freedom of travel, equality and respect of all differences in race. Number four, creating abundance. Creating peace through redistribution of social resources, through hospitality and encouraging and abundance of food, shelter, and establishment of a thriving income for each individual. Establishing access to education, number five. Universal education is the right of every single human to have access. Number six, access to reverse conditions. Every individual 
need to have access to the knowledge of how to reverse any condition. Number seven, humanitarian services. In case of imminent disasters of this planet, on this planet or in the universe, we work through the soul and elevate humanity, connecting to other souls, you create opportunity to support souls anywhere on this planet. Number eight, the ethos and conduct. Every soul carries the ability of knowledge between right and wrong. We, the Universal Council, through our conduct, show the path. Here is Pia, uh, representing the Danish language you see. Strategizing overview. The Universal Council embraces every soul with an abundance, abundance of hospitality and servitude. We welcome all wishes arriving from everywhere. They will process through the core team, Earth Council, Universal Council supporters, language communities, knowledge seekers, and the Keshe Foundation, and processed by the UC members involved in the operation of the different councils, and in the future, processed even more through the soul level communication. Solutions originate from the soul level operation of the Universal Council, materializes in the legislation level, and then are implemented in the appropriate communities. The manifestation in matter state involves the relevant UC members, core team, Earth Council, Universal Council supporters, language communities, knowledge seekers, and the KISS Foundation. Solutions come from the KISS Foundation Plasma Science and Technology. Hi, it's Pete again, and here we talk about structuring. So what Pia and read from the previous slide is the explanation of this picture. As they say, the picture is worth a thousand words. And I think all the knowledge seekers, uh, we also appreciate the pictures that we are given during the teachings. I think they help to understand the concepts a little bit more. So if we think about this diagram as a clock, just for me to uh, make it easier to explain, we can see that around 10, 11 o'clock, we have a line representing a wish that's arriving from any direction or any level. Obviously these days, we mostly operate or work in the physicality um, as we lack a little bit of understanding of our own soul and the operation of the soul. But in the future, that communication can arise from, from any direction, any level, be it spoken word or the soul level communication. And then at nine o'clock, we see an arrow going in the opposite direction. So whatever happens in the, in the middle of the circle, we will talk about this in a, in a second, the solutions are decided on and delivered. And, and that arrow represents these solutions going out across the different layers, the different circles. We can think of it as an, as an onion as well. So to reach any level, whichever level it came from. At the same time, at around seven o'clock, we see the line of communication with the universal community. Same as our soul is, with the, is in a line with the creator in the same sense, there is also that line of communication between the Universal Council, between the whole of Earth and the Universal community. And between sort of one, two o'clock and three o'clock, we see all the souls. We see all those taking part in the implementation of the solution, UC members, core team, uh, Earth Council members, UC supporters, language communities, knowledge seekers, Cash Foundation as well, an important factor in bringing these solutions out. 
Next slide, please. And this is a another yet another graphical representation of what we discussed up to now. So we can see in the middle, we have that big blue circle where all the needs are met for all beings. We can think of it as a as a womb of a mother. This is where all the needs of a child are met: energy, food, shelter, and other aspects, perhaps which um, do not apply exactly to um, to the human embryo. But we see a lot of other aspects of our physical living outside of the womb as well and all, all these aspects that need to be met and satisfied based on the needs. Around that we have the, the peaceful environment which we create through the work we carry out through the correct conduct of our own soul. And on the outer layer we see the delivery of the solutions. We see a multitude of language community where we have the UC members, Earth Council members, UC supporters, knowledge seekers, all those that we list for um, taking part in the implementation of, of that solution, of bringing the solution in and bringing the change into the community. Thank you. Salam, namaste, salute. I am Shweta Anwar. I represent UC Hindi language. The decision-making process. No majority will infringe on the freedom of any minority. Consensus will be achieved through dialogue and the elevation of the soul of the man. Every decision must be of benefit to all. Every being will be respected, treated fair, and equal in all aspects. The soul of beings will govern every action in a peaceful manner, bringing peace to the planet and all who live here must always be our goal. Serving the needs of all is the only way to achieve this. In the council, once one promotes a certain motion for it to establish as effective course for elevation of the souls or collective souls of the race of the planet or do something for good of the man, then the souls will understand and support the motion of the pros uh, presented case to their intention and support of the soul and not by voting. Thank you. I am Shamila representing UC Arabic. As so far you see, we have for our guidance, we have our five pillars we have the principles, we have the policies, we structured as one. So we are ready to, and we have the, the decision-making process. So we are ready to start functioning as following from the one structure. The Universal Council decide the actions to be taken and to be deployed, to be implemented here for the communities. Thank you. Next. Once the decisions of actions are taken, the, the actions will be deployed through the communities with the teams here. As you see, the deployment or the implementation will be done with the community languages, with the knowledge seekers, with the Keshe Foundation, with the Earth Council, with the Universal Council. So the involvement of all or as one will be doing implementation here. It will look like, like, like stars everywhere bringing um, happiness and fulfilling the needs of the communities. Next, please. Then through all the planet, you will see here the actions like um, here, this example uh, was the deployment of the solution brought for the 
coronavirus. Here you see, we represented here an example how it will be uh, um, showing through all the planet, all the actions. Here, imagine this color, you see this color blue, it's one action. Imagine tomorrow, we will decide to have many actions to answer the need of the population of the communities. You will see, for example, let's see agriculture. So we, we for example, we decide to deploy and to, to implement a solution for food. You will, you might see green uh, shining stars all over, etc. So we are now reaching uh, understanding and uh, readiness. We are ready to concretely uh, start with all the communities. I am Emmanuel representing UC Maltese language operating. The solutions proposed by the Universal Council are implemented with the help of the Keshe Foundation core team, Earth Council, Universal Council supporters, language communities, knowledge seekers, and the Keshe Foundation. Jamila again. So to complete our guidance, we have here concrete areas of actions with the Universal Council members, which are responsible or taking responsibility for the actions here to serve. These actions are the translation of the policies to be implemented. And here from the missions, we shall trigger the plan for the actions to come. Each, all the UCs will take responsibility here, like peace and freedom, communication, justice, distribution, uh, community support, ecology, resource and technology, agriculture and food, education, teaching, employment and job, jobs, health and the medical care, culture and wellness and global administration, universal community relation. Those are all the missions which we are ready, ready to take and to, um, to work on with all the teams here we mentioned before. First, we take responsibility, then we define priorities, then we make specific, we make a strategy and specific strategy to localize in the, within the communities. Of course, with coordination with all the teams and we start operating, means we listen to the community and we serve. So now we give you an idea about the next steps to come. Thank you. You have here the links to the documents. Again, so the UC Charter, the UC Mandate, the Earth Council Constitution, and all our contact emails. Next, please. So with all the Universal Council, we thank you. I give freely from my soul to all souls in existence Take what you need. I am present, the Universal Council. I am present. I am present. I am present. 
I am present. I am I'm present. present. I am present. I am present. I am present. I am present. Thank you, Rick. Next. And I am present too. Thank you. Thank you. Now, in the second part of the presentation, we are going to listen to the nation. Next, please. Okay, thank you, Rick. Welcome again. My name is Przemek in, in Polish, or for easy pronunciation in English, and I'm the UC member for the Polish language. Poland, let me I introduce you to this presentation for a while. Po in Poland, maybe, okay, maybe we have uh, not the best roads uh, in the world, but still Poland is very green. It's a uh, full of energy country, a lot of nature present around, despite of so many who try to take us apart, and they still do these days internally or externally, the country has survived in its state and there is a lot of um, development on different levels happening in there. So this presentation is not only to inform you of what we are doing in the Polish community, but we also hope that this is somehow educational and inspirational. And as always, all the feedback is welcome. And as Ella said last week, it all starts from the teachings. And in my view, it ends with the teaching being applied. It cannot work differently. Otherwise, we are a bunch of hypocrites. And the soul brings the feedback eventually. So we, get, we do get that information back, that feedback from the soul to correct our doing. There's no need going around and preaching if you yourself do not represent what you teach. Here we go back to the ethos of the foundation, to the commandments. And I hope this is also something that's, that's going to be present and visible throughout, throughout the presentation. And it's good to take that perspective as we presented earlier last week and today that the Universal Council members are there in every country, every language to facilitate. They are the bridge to link their needs to the solutions as we've seen on the previous diagram. diagram. Next slide, please. So the past, let's talk a little bit about the past. We, we had conference in 2017, very well received, over 150 people. We were holding a number of workshops, different teachers teaching the basics of plasma and also math graphs in the past and so on. So that was all also happening in the past. Private and public teachings related to the past also relate to the present. There is the YouTube channel with full teachings and also short focused videos. We try to translate within our small team almost the entirety of, of every teaching. So this knowledge base is building up it's important to remember the work we've done and where it is because that's the legacy for others who, who are new to this technology, who are new to what we are talking about to come and pick it up from these sources. We have the official Facebook page, uh, over 600 members on that page. We do different community initiatives. We did because this is about the past. We raised, for example, funds for a, for a mammography meet. We continuously are helping those who are seeking knowledge and seeking help, obviously. You cannot help somebody who doesn't ask for help, who doesn't come seeking knowledge, otherwise you impose it onto them. And we come to more and more, uh, sorry, I, that's still in the past. So understanding more and more in working via the soul and mention, this is what we have been trying to do and we are doing um, since I think we started learning about this technology. We are still in that process of searching the soul, seeking the soul. Next slide, please. So in the present, we have everything I mentioned before. Currently, there is no scheduled conference. Workshops are on hold due to the corona situation, as we know. But as the situation relaxes in, in different countries, these will be brought back whenever there is a possibility of running face-to-face -face workshops. We have community initiatives, for example, focused on the coronavirus situation. 
So we have knowledge seekers involved in producing the ganses and having the sets of the different cups ready, ready to send to those who need the help. So we are trying to continuously provide the help to those who are seeking knowledge and help. And again, understanding more and more in working via the soul dimension. And obviously there is the whole um, wealth of information of work that we do on a daily basis, which is the private and public teaching, YouTube channel, and Facebook page. Next one, please. So let's break it down a little. Um, when we talk about the present, let's talk about physicality, emotion, and the soul. Let's break it down into all these three levels as each plays a part and carries its own functions and its own understanding. So the soul carries the blueprint, the structure, and the physical environment around shapes the physicality of, of that soul. It's like a carpenter that receives a piece of wood that already uh, carries its own structure of the tree, it comes from another tree, and the carpenter shapes it. So this is the, our environment shaping the information coming from the soul into what we see in physicality. And here we see the direction of creation. We see that the physicality is the manifestation of the soul in the given dimension, and the soul dictates the structure. And in all this, there is no hierarchy. All souls are equal and in the same way as all body, body organs are equal, if we go back to the understanding of the human body. So we have tried a couple of times for the structure to be official, and a couple of months ago, we turned into the direction of organizing it pretty much without the structure, structure without a hierarchy, where people uh, go and do according to their soul, to what they feel they should be doing, what they feel comfortable in doing. And if they need support, there are, there are all of us, all the other knowledge seekers and uh, those present in the Polish community who appear uh, when the time is right and or can be contacted for help and the solution comes in organically. And in that process, everybody takes responsi responsibility and does for what they do, for the fruits of their work, and they, they organize it based on, on their own understanding and feeling and the whole the rest of the structure the rest of the people are there to support and this is all based on knowledge and trust where we trust each other so the knowledge seekers currently they produce trimmed videos we try to take out portions of teachings that focus on particular topic um, for example on the understanding of the soul different aspects of it or in in the example of the coronavirus these are the videos explaining the different apps and applications and so on. Also, out of the teachings, we create written documents and instructions in Polish so that these are circulated on the Facebook page and to those who need these and don't necessarily have the time or the understanding coming from, from watching the videos. So all these materials are there to support the knowledge seekers. Cup of Life, guns and sets, uh, as I mentioned, they are sent over mail to those who, who are in need. We have additional Zoom sessions for, for new people, especially those coming from the workshops where uh, the discussion is focused mainly on um, the basics of the plasma, but also going back to the understanding that's hidden in the health teachings. Not hidden, but explained in the health teachings. So we also try to go back to the understanding of the human body. And as we also hear in the public teachings these days, that there is a lot of understanding in these teachings. And other items that um, knowledge seekers produce physically are, for example, infinity loops or soaps or clothes, clots for cleaning, and so on. So these are all the products that are there for knowledge seekers, for those who need it, to use in order to change or alter their environment so that it becomes a safe environment and also the one that can also feed us or protect us, for example, from the coronavirus. Next one, please. emotions another level the humanity will accept this technology out of fear but we knowledge seekers we carry no fear but love for giving and we accept it because we carry the following understanding emotion is the transition matter and the cause of many physical conditions it can create problems or bring a lot of beauty and we carry in that process of teaching and knowledge sharing we carry no fear the cycle continues in one way or another and in that process, we go back to the understanding also of the commandments, especially of the aspect of detachment. Next one, please.
emotions. It's all about being a responsible creator. Emotions are the trans transition matter. On one end, we have the soul, its wishes, its ethos, and so on. And on the other side, we have the execution, how it appears in the physicality. And this is something also uh, scientists in the past confirmed. Here we have Dr. Masaru Emoto, the famous rice experiment, and we see what love, the emotion of love towards the rice can give, what hate results in, and also what is the result of indifference. So we see that these two states, hate and indifference, doesn't really carry uh, the outcome that we are probably expecting. So it's, it, it's important to also work and focus on that level because this is where we create a lot of different things that, on different levels. I think not only in this language group, but I think in totality, we are increasingly becoming aware of the responsibility of our creation and caring for it also at the emotional level, like for a child. We have to be aware of what we create through our emotions. It's like bringing up a, a child. And this topic is a huge topic. Just Let's just look at Winston Hitch's teachings where he talks about planet Earth being a nursery for souls. So there is... I'm not going to go too much in depth into that topic, but souls are born here and will elevate to the highest strength to create planets, stars, galaxies, entire universe. So the environment we provide, the love we feed them with, that the way we are, they are brought up, this is what's going to dictate the next cycles of creation. This is what's represented on the picture in the picture on the right. So we see uh, that love, that emotion, unconditional giving and loving that we are trying to spread across the planet to different communities so that the process continues, the elevation continues in a, in a right and harmonious way. Next one, please. And this is again where we go back to the commandments. This is about the soul, another level of understanding. So the day of judgment, the day of judgment is every day when you and nobody else you judge yourself and nobody else. So this is that correction point where we can check, we can assess ourselves and judge whether to go left or right, which decision to take, what action to make. So that's that's very important. Uh, as humans, I think we often look to the left, look to the right. We take a reference point, um, or we try to judge others. And this is not this is not the right ethos. We have to focus on ourselves because through our own elevation, elevation of our soul. Only when we elevate, we have something to offer. We can work with the principle of the stronger feeds the weaker, and we can, through elevation of our own soul, we can add the totality. So we are working more and more via the soul dimension. And people, as I said earlier, people go and do according to their soul if they feel they need, then the support and others up here who are able to deliver a solution and each in that process each can only judge themselves another thing that we also try to work in within the polish community are so-called banking sessions which is nothing else but trying to understand the transfer between transfer of the fields between the soul of physicality and the soul of the man how we can feed our soul also through breathing techniques perhaps starting starting there but eventually getting down to the understanding that we can be in that process we can go deeper we can reach out to our soul and work from this level if we wish to so it's just a matter of standing still focusing on it for a minute collectively supporting each other and working together towards, towards a simple uh, a common goal And this is something that was also written in the Bible. We have um, here the words, beware of the false prophets who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly are revenge wolves. You will know them by their fruits. Grapes are not gathered from thorn bushes, nor figs from thistles, are they? So every good tree bears good fruit, but the bad tree bears bad fruit. A good tree cannot produce bad fruit, nor can a bad tree produce good fruit. Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. So then you will know them by the fruit. And this is, these are the fruits we have to care about. This are, these are the fruits we create at the soul level and we bring them out also to our emotions. So we have to be um, 
first of all, looking inwards, looking inside, trying to understand our soul, especially with the with the right ethos, bearing in mind the commandments and these correction points where we judge ourselves to make sure that we do what is right and what's correct with the ethos. Next one, please. So presently, we are also faced with a new understanding. We hear from since the outbreak of Corona, I think a lot of knowledge has been brought up and explained and we are faced with this new understanding of space and travel. We also hear about new systems of knowledge distribution through, through non-structural channels of administration, environmental systems for converting the pollution. So the products that the foundation is bringing out, these are not coincidental, it all appears at the right time when the need appears, the solution is there. So we see, how timely all these are introduced and how well it all fits together and it just proves the correctness of the technology in reducing the effects of of, um, of the virus. And we have seen many explanations by Mr. Kesh, which uh, scientists either discovered weeks or months later, or they're still trying to get to that level of understanding. So in all that process, we see the correctness of the technology where we support the knowledge seekers with the solution, with the knowledge, so that they have all the means to be to be fine, to be to be healthy, to get out of this corona situation if there is. Next one, please. Future. So the past is over. It's in the past. The future has not happened yet. And the future will bring whatever we live and breathe in the present time. So an important aspect is first of all education and focusing on what it is that we are doing right now. These are the seeds of knowledge. This is what we are planting, and this is what is going to start the next cycle of, of, of creation. And this is also to create the, that environment for change, that environment in which collectively the change can be brought. Next one, please. And this is a message. This is a call from a supporter in, in Poland. This is the original writing um, because I'm not here just to talk about my own perspective, but bring the, the community perspective. And this is exactly the call for support that we got from the knowledge seekers. I'm going to take time to read it. Due to the upcoming changes in the government, which we understand as the soul of physicality and the nation as the soul imprisoned by the soul of physicality, we would like to ask all the UCEC and core members to raise the Polish soul of physicality and to support the upcoming presidential and government change in Poland for a loving and brave, sufficient in love and devotion to the nation to become part of it and reject all domination. For which we thank them and we love them because they showed us our weaknesses, which on the anvil of love and lack of judgment, we would like to transform into strength. To pump new equality, which will allow the development of a new system based on one nation, one race, one planet, one coin, cash coin. And I think it's it's um, interesting is that last aspect. I think we are, you know, we all communities, all uh, nations are touched by the virus, by the corona situation. And one thing that changes is the increasing unemployment, the, situ the financial situation of people getting getting slightly worse. And here is also a room for governments to talk about that aspect of, of our living, how they're going to get out of the crisis, what solutions also those um, at the financial level they're going to bring. And we know we have the solution already. So this is the wish. I'm going to read it out. If, um, Rick, if you can switch to the next slide, this is the only slide I'm going to uh, read in Polish because that's, that's a direct wish and call support from a knowledge seeker but this presentation as it is we meet on thursdays and sundays at 9 p.m central european time and this is where this presentation is going to be given in polish so that the polish community can also receive what i showed today in english but i read this one slide prośba o wsparcie i życzenie ze względu na nadchodzące zmiany w rządzie które rozumiemy jako duszę fizyczności który rozumiemy jako duszę fizyczności a naród jako duszę uwiezioną przez duszę fizyczności, chcielibyśmy poprosić wszystkich członków UC, EC i Rdzenia o wzniesienie polskiej duszy fizyczności oraz o wsparcie nadchodzącej zmiany prezydenckiej i rządowej w Polsce na kochającą i odważną, 
na wystarczającą w miłości i oddaniu narodowi, aby stać się jego częścią i odrzucić karę dominację, za które im dziękujemy i ich kochamy, ponieważ pokazały nam one naszą słabość, którą na kowadle miłości i braku osądu chcielibyśmy przekuć w siłę, by wpompować nową równość, która pozwoli rozwinąć nowy system oparty na jednym narodzie, jednej rasie, jednej planecie, jednej monecie. Next one, please. And this is where the presentation concludes. I apologize if I take slightly too much time. These are all the contact details that one may need in order to reach us. The email address or for myself, Facebook page, the official Facebook page that was set up by the foundation. It's called Kesh Fundacja Polska in brackets, KF Polish official. And as I said, we do meet on Zoom every Thursday and Sunday for the public teachings at 9 p.m. where we present the currently going uh, knowledge seekers workshop, the translation of them and explanation of them. Thank you very much for your time, attention and listening. Thank you. Good morning. Um, I am Azar Yusi Palsi. Uh, I'm going to start uh, the presentation with the invocation. The invocation is in uh, Sanskrit, but I'm going to say it in English um, from untruth to truth, from darkness to light, from ignorance to enlightenment, from mortality to immortality. May I be led on his. Peace, peace. Um, salam Aziz. Man Azar Hastam, UC Farsi. As in the Shulum Konamke Basha, Bakteke, Ek, the Wujuduma Dalin Zemin, Bakhodovan Basha, the Wujudu. Mikos Nishum Bidu Basha Kiman, Tulumis Hodam, the Wujudu, and Mikos Basha. اینو بفهمه و همونطور که خداوند از چیزایی که به وجود و دور لذت میبود میخواست بشر هم از اون به همون اندازه که خداوند لذت میبره لذت ببره و به ترهای مختلفی خداوند این کار رو برای بشر کرد که بهش بفهمونه اولین کاری که کرد پیغمبر ها رو بود که اگه میدونین ایسا، موسا، حضرت محمد رو بود که بهشون بگه چطوری به خودتون خودتون رو بشناسین ولی متاسفانه چیزی که شد بعد از اینکه این پیغبران اومدن چیزی که به وجود اومد انسان چه کاری که کرد مسجد ساخت کلیسا ساخت سنگال ساخت و قبلا اگه هفت روز هفته رو دنبال این بود که ما از کجا اومدیم به کجا داریم میدیم و شاید هم یه سرمانشون روحشون باز میشد با این چیزی که پیغمبر براشون آوردن تزی که انسان با این دانشی که پیغمبر آوردن مسجد و کلیسا و سنگال ساختن شیش روز هفته دوزیدن و کشتن و خوردن یه روز هفته شم میرن توی مسجد و چرچ و سنگال میشنن و از خدا خواسته بخشش میکنن و این چیزی بوده روندی بوده که انسان داشته و در سالیانی که بعد از پیغمبرا انسان داره کورکورانه زندگی میکنه در حدود دو درصد انسان واقعا داره زندگی میکنه ولی 98 درصد دارن کورکورانه زندگی میکنن یعنی هیچی نمیدونه اصلا زندگی چی هست وقتی مثل کش اومدن نالجی که مثل کش اومدن ببینین توی دنیا همیشه دو قطب بوده یه قطب دانش بوده یه قطب کسایی بودن که مذهب داشتن یعنی همیشه دانش ایش وقت با مذهب قاطی نمی شده. مذهب نیمده که مذهب بیاده. مذهب اومده که به اسم مذهب خدا رو به مردم نشون بده خدایی که تو خودشون بوده. ولی اینو سواش کردن. برای اولین بار مثل کش وقتی دانش جهانی رو برای بشریت اوورده اوورده این دانش که این واقعیتش اینه که اون بزرگترین بزرگترین و قدرترین اصلاحی که تو دنیا وجود داره تو مغز ماست. که این رو ما نفهمیدیم و مثل کش 
با دانشی که بوده اینو میخواد به ما نشون بده ولی متاسفانه ما هنوز داریم کوکوانه را میدیم uh, Can I have the next slide please? چیزی که میبینیم در حالت توی دنیا ما هیچی توی دنیا اتفاقی نیست یعنی دنیا یه چیز خیلی منظمی یعنی مولا درزش نمیده هر اتفاقی میفته یه دلیلی داره شما اگه یه دونه ذره سوزن یه نوک سوزن روی زمین میفته تمام دنیا رو تکون میدین یه فکر میکنی تمام دنیا رو تکون میدین این چیزی بوده که ما نفهمیدیم ولی هیچ چیزی تصادفی نیست نیکس سلاید پلیز ببینید چیزی که هست ایران رو که نگاه میکنین وقتی میگیم هیچی تصادفی نیست ایران ظرف چهل سال گذشته از لحاظ سیاسی و اقتصادی زیر تعریم بوده از تمام کشورهایی که تو دنیا بودن از طرف کشور غربی فشارهای زیادی روی دولت ایران و مردم ایران بوده و این یه دلیل داره ببینیم <تصفح> نلسون مندلا اگه زندان نمیرفت نلسون مندلا نمیشد ایران این چل سالی که براش پیش اومد این هدیه است این هدیه بوده که به شما داده شده که به این موقعیتی بیاین که این دانش رو خیلی بهتر از آدم مدیه بتونیم بفهمیم ما الان وقتی نگاه میکنیم توی ایران ما 2019 توی جانویه با حسن جان کلاس های فارسی رو شروع کردیم تنزی که کلاس های فارسی شروع شد و تنزی که مردم ایران این دانش یاد میگیرن اصلا این دانش رو میبرن یعنی مثل یه زمین خوش که میمونه وقتی آب میزی روش آب سری میره تو یعنی دانش اصلا دانش خورده میشه <تصفيق> مثلا وقتی نگاه میکنی 80 درصد 90 درصد مردم کسایی که میان تو کلاس ها کسایی که با من تماس میگیرن کسایی هستن که 10 سال 15 سال دوره دوره توی اعتقال روح بودن پرواز روح بودن یعنی طرز فشاری که روی انسان های آدم های ایرانی اومده اینا اصلا از لازم موقعیتشون با انسان های دیگه خیلی فرق میکنه ما ایرانی های هستن که توی امریکا کلی هم دیگه فرق میکنه اون شرایطی که به ایران به وجود اومد ایران رو به این نقطه کشونه که از لحاظ تکنولوژی توی سر تکنولوژی هر نقطه ایران رو به شما سوری ارز 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 Can you hear me? Much better, thank you. تمام نقطه ایران تمام ایرانیان دنبال این نالج هستن. Next slide please. الان با جریانی که تو ایران در حدود توی مارچ کرونا وایروس توی ایران به وجود اومد ما که از سال پیش شروع کردیم دست دادن با این کرونا وایروس که شروع شد دانشجوهای توی کلاس فارسی خیلی زیاد تر شد یعنی از تمام به خاطر اینکه این کرونا وایروس به همه جای قوم تهران کلی شهر دیگه رفته بود این همه جا پخش شد و کرونا وایروس یه دونه به قول معروف یه دونه هدیه دیگه برای ایرانیا بود با این کرونا وایروس این دانشی که توی ایران داشت پخش می شد صد برابر شد صد برابر که نه هزار برابر ایشتر می یه میلیون برابر هر خونه ای هر کجایی هر شهری هر دهی به این دانش آشنا شدن Next slide please الان که نگاه می کنیم یه یه داستانی رو براتون میگم ببینید یه آقایی هست که میان تو کلاس های فارسی ما این آقا سر شعرهای قشنگی از مولانا میگن و من با این آقا با, با هم دیگه شروع کردیم تکس کردن و این آقا برای من شعرهای مولانا رو بعضی موقع میفرستم یه با بحث شد که من برای ایشون گفتم که مولانا چون یه کتاب خونده بودم فوری رو لاو لاو که مولانا مولانا شد به خاطر شمس تبریز ایشون حرف جالبی زد گفتش که مولانا دوش سنگینی به دوشش بود شمس تبریز وقتی اومد این چیز سنگونه دوش ایشون برداشت برای همین مولانا مولانا شد 
چیزی که من به ایشون گفتم گفتم که مولانا مثل یه آبی بود که پشتی صد بود این صد وقتی آب پشتی صد وای سوده قشنگی نداره مولانا شمس دبلیس کاری که کرد این در صد رو باز کرد و این آب جاری شد وقتی شما آب رو نگاه میکنید جاری میشه به همه چی تشنگی همه چی رفت میکنه به زمین تشنگیش رو رفت میکنه گولا رو تشنگیش رو رفت میکنه حیوانه رو تشنگیش رو رفت میکنه انسان ها رو تشنگیش رو رفت میکنه این بود کاری بود که شمس تبدیز کرد الان نگاه که میکنین دانش پلازما توی ایران الان مثل همون آب میمونه که پشت صده یعنی این آب داره جمع میشه و البته توی ایران ایرانی ها خود ما تمام همبتنان ما دارن این کار انجام میدن سپاه پاسداران به صورتی دارن انجام میدن به همه مردم میرسونن که انصار رو کمک میکنن ولی این دانش سراسری نشده یعنی یعنی توی تلویزیون رادیو نشریه ها توی مدرسه ها دانش، دانشگاه ها هنوز نیمده این یه مسئولیتی که مسئولیت دولتی ببینین الان دانش ما از 2008 مثل کش این دانش رو برای شما توی ایران رو بردن یعنی اولین اسپیس تکنولوژی که یک کشوری داره ایران داره یعنی بالاترین قدرت رو توی جهان ایران داره این 2008 ده. بعد از اون هم وقتی مثل کش شروع کردن درست دادن در نقاط مختلف ایران مردم ایران شروع کردن رو یاد گرفتن بعد از اون 2019 که ما شروع کردیم بیشتر پخش شده الان طوری که هست این آب پشت سر جمع شده این وظیفه دولت ماست که این در صد رو باز کنه و این آب رو بذاره جریان پیدا کنه و این آب به همه جا بره این مسئولیت مسئولیت فرد برای کشور خودتون نیست این مسئولیت مسئولیت جهانی که به دوش شما گذاشته شده ببینید شما یه سری از کسایی که در رهبری ما هستن از اقوام روحانی هستن کسانی هستن که هم عجد خدا رو توی این دنیا میخوان هم عجد خدا رو توی دنیای دیگه میخوان ببینین دو تا نقطه اینجا من میخوام برای تو مشخص کنم یکی این که ما وقتی نگاه میکنیم توی از لحاظ جهانی کشور ما یا کشور مثل ما ترجی که بوده ما نقشی که بازی کردیم این بوده که کشورهایی مثل کشور امریکا یا اسرائیل یا کشورهای دیگه همیشه نقشه کشیدن و ما عکس عمل نشون دادیم یعنی چی؟ مثلا اومدن به عراق هم بکردن ما به عنوان همسایه چون دوست همسایه رو دوست داریم رفتیم به مردم عراق کمک کردیم اومدن توی سوریه مردم سوریه رو شروع کردن کشتن ما چیکار کردیم به عنوان دوست همسایه رفتیم به مردم سوریه کمک کردیم همین چند وقت پیش یکی از بزرگترین اصرای پاستاران رو توی عراق زدن کشتن ما چیکار کردیم؟ ما رفتیم زدیم پایگان های امریکای تو عراق زدیم بمبارانشو کردیم از بینشون بودیم چرا الان در موقعیتی که ایران نشسته در موقعیتی که از لحاظ جوانی نشسته این مثل یه ایتیاد میمونه ایران یه ایتیادی داره که وای میشه میشینه یه کسی یه کاری بکنه مثل امریکا و ما عکس العمل نشین میدیم این ایتیاده این ایتیاد رو باید ترک کنیم باید شما الان موقعیتی که داریم شما نقشه بکشین و بزنین دیگران عکس العمل نشون بدن این جای باید عوض بشه نمیتونه این جایی که الان گذاشتین که عکس العمل هم عکس العمل همش نشون بدین نمیتونه باشه دومین نقطه ای که میخوام بگم اینه ببینین یه داستان بهتون میگم یه مردی بود یه مردی بود مسلمون بود میرفت مسجدش میرفت دعاش رو میکرد به زن مردم نگاه نمیکرد خمس و زکات میداد همه کارا رو درست میکرد بعد این زد و مرد رفت تو درگاه خدا خدا بهش گفتش که خب بگو ببینم چه کار کردی و خدا یا من همه کاری که تو گفتی بودی من کردم نماز کندم دعا کردم زن دیگران نگاه نکردم بچه هم با بزرگ کردم خمز و زکات دادم و حالا اومدم به درگاه تو عجعیت تو رو میخوام خدا بهش گفتش که یاد میاد یه همسایه داشتی گفتش که آره یه خانمی بودش شوهر و شوهرش مرد و بعد بچه هاش اومدن پول و پلش رو همه رو برداشتن و مادر رو بدون هیچی گذاشتن بعضی موقع من شبا میدیدم این گریه میکنه از بیغذای تو اقل من بعد خدا بهش گفتش که خب این خانمی که گریه میکرد از بیغذای تو کاری براش کردی؟ گفت نه گفت خب من خمس و زکات هم میدادم بعد خدا گفتش که آخه اون خمس و زکاتی که میدادی به مسجد آیا میدونستی به کجا میره یه همسایه که بغل توه که غذا نقدر بخوره 
آیا خمس و زکات میرفت به آخونده که تو مسجده این جریان هم جریان شماست کسانی که توی رهبریت هستن و الان رهبریت رو دارن و عجل خدایی رو تو این دنیا نتن تو این دنیا و دنیای بعدی طلب دارن ببینید من آرزو میکنم تمام شما که توی رهبریت هستین هزاران سال تو این زمین زندگی کنین و هیچ وقت هم نمیرین ولی مردن ما هیچ وقت تعیین نشده نیست من ممکنه امشب بخوام بلند نشم شما ممکنه امشب بخوای بلند نشید شما که فرد رفتی به درگاه خدا خدا بهت میگه که تو ببینید یه آخوندی که نشسته تو قوم توی حوزه قوم داره به ده تا همسایه‌اش چیز میده گنس میده کمک میکنه اون تو موقعیتش کارشو داره انجام میده شما که تو رهبریت نشستی وقتی میرین به درگاه خدا خدا بهت میگه که شما یه دانش پلازما آگاهی داشتی؟ نمیتونی بگی نداشتن. میگه میدونستی با این دانش پلازما مردم داشتن خوب میشدن هم نه تنها تو ایران تو کشورهای دیگه نمیتونی بگی نه نمیدونستن. بنابراین دانشی رو که داری و آشنایی داری جواب خدا رو چه خواهی داد؟ اجزایت خدا رو از چی میخوای؟ کدوم اجزایت رو میخوایی؟ کدوم به شو؟ به خدا میخوایی چی بگی؟ مهمترین بالاترین مسئولیت الان دروش شماست نه تنها برای مردم ایران بلکه به تمام جهان این چه سالی که شما اونجا نشستین مردم ایران اینطوری ترهیم شدن و زیر فشار بودن این یه دلیل داشته دلیلش هم اینه مردم ما تشته این دانشن اون صد رو باید باز کنیم آب و بزنی روان بشه شما مسئول تمام مردم دنیا که الان کرونا دارن نه تنها اون مسئول تمام مردم دنیا که مرضی های مختلف تا میتونه خوب بشن شما چطوری میتونید به خدا بگین که من خبر نداشتم این مسئولیتیه که شما به عهده دارین و جواب خدا رو باید خودتون بدین و خودتون هم میدونین که یه روزی شما میرین و اینجا نمیمونین اینجا ببینین شما منو میتونن لباس هم ازم بگیرن خونم رو ازم بگیرن ماشین هم ازم بگیرن همه چی ازم بگیرن ولی بزرگترین بزرگترین قدرت من ترین چیزی که خدا به من داده تو مغز منه من میتونم بکنم توی قار یه گل بزنم ولی اون چیزی که تو مغز رو ازم نمیتونم بگیرم و این مسئولیت شماست و تو این راه که ما داریم میریم و مستکش اومدن و راه جهانی برای صلح برای یک ملت یک نژاده شما مسئولی کشور دیگه مسئول نیستن شما مسئولی اونا نمیگه ما روحانی هستیم شما میگیم ما روحانی هستیم شما این که میخوام برین تو اجز درگاه خدا اجزت خدا رو بگیرین دانالد تراب نمیگه من میخوام برم به اون دنیا اجزت خدا رو بگیرم شما داریم میگی بعد من مسئولیت شما خیلی سنگینه ببینید این آبی که پشت صد وایسوده یا شما این در صد رو باز میکنیم بذاره بره یا آب انقدر قوی میشه این صد خراب میشه شما هم با خودش میبره بعد من این دو تا انتخاب داریم با اینجا یا انتخاب میکنیم در صد رو باز میکنیم یا میذاریم این صد بیاد ما رو همه رو ببره دو تا, دو تا انتخاب پیشتر نداریم این مسیجی بود که من میخواستم به تمام ایرانی های عزیز بدم به مقصدم به رهبری ایران و برای هموطان های عزیزم مسیجی که دارم اینه که ببینید منی که اینجا نشستم من اونجا نیستم تنها کاری که میکنم این توی زندگی چیز فیزیکالی خیلی سخت زندگی کردم کار از پیش بودن خیلی سخت بود ولی توی روح توی دوره روح توی به قول مردم روح خیلی آسانه خیلی آسونه شما به جایی که با بچه‌تون کلمه کلب بکنین با همسایه‌تون دعوا بکنین با آخوند محلتون چیز کنین با شهردار خونه‌تون چیز کنین بریم به طرف صلح با صلحتون به صلح همه اینو بدین اگه بچه‌تون گوش نمی‌کنه با صلحش حرف بزنین بچه‌تون دو هفته درست میشه دو دقیقه دو دقیقه بیشتر طول نمی‌کشه تو صبح که بلند میشین بگین من از روح هم به روح تمام آدمای تو دنیا میدم هر چقدر می‌خوای بعد من تنهایی میگن یه دست صدا نداره من یه نفر اگه همه ما با هم بشیم همه ما میتونیم اینو بکشیم بالا و الان موقعشه یعنی وقت دیگه ای نداره همین وقتی که الان داره نکست سلاید پلیز
go to the next slide, please. چیزی که الان میخوام بگم اینه که الان آینده دست ماست دست همگی ماست و امیدوارم که تمام ایرانی که صدای من میشنون این کمک کرده باشه که بتونیم با هم دیگه این دنیای جدیدی که داره میاد جلو بتونیم هممون با هم تجربه کنیم و هممون با هم با صلح و صفا در کنار هم زندگی کنیم و تمام این دنیایی که الان داریم در پشت, در در پشت بذاریم و به سوی یا آینده خیلی باز با شادابی و هر انسانی که این من آرزو میکنم برای هر انسانی که تو این زمین زندگی میکنه اون چیزی رو که من دارم تجربه میکنم تجربه کنم ببین زندگی خیلی ساده است و هم همه وجودتون آرزو میکنم تمام وجودتون هر لحظه پر از شادی و خوشی باشه و هر لحظه زندگیتون لذت ببینیم مرسی تینکیو تینکیو ریک Hello. Rick, can you hear me? Uh, yes, uh, yes, go ahead. Uh, next slide, Rick. Hello, myself, Ketan. I am representing Marathi language. I live in India, in state of Maharashtra. So Marathi is the 10th most spoken language with 83 million people. Marathi is the primary spoken in Maharashtra state in India. Marathi speakers are scattered all over in the different nations in USA, Australia, Gulf and other European countries. Next slide, Rick. त्र्याऐंशी दशलक्ष लोकांसह मराठी ही दहाव्या क्रमांकाची भाषा आहे मराठी प्रामुख्याने भारतातील महाराष्ट्र राज्यात बोलली जाते युएस ऑस्ट्रेलिया अखाती देश आणि युरोपियन देशांमध्ये मराठी भाषिक वेगवेगळ्या राष्ट्रांमध्ये विखुरल्या आहेत नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट सो we have started teaching about this technology in local area we have started facebook group and telegram group to inform and educate people we had also contacted state governments and had meeting with government officials regarding applications of this technology next trick ammi amcha tantrajnan kshetra ya tantrajna badda shikavna shuruvat keli ahe ammi facebook group ani telegram group suru kela ahe लोकांना माहिती आणि शिक्षण देण्यासाठी आम्ही राज्य सरकारशी संपर्क साधला आहे आणि या तंत्रज्ञानाचा वापराबाबत शासकीय अधिकाऱ्यांशी मी बैठक घेतली आहे नेक्स्ट अवर मेन गोल इज टू ब्रिंग मराठी स्पीकिंग कम्युनिटी कम टुगेदर इन हार्मनी पीस लव्ह अँड रिस्पेक्ट we are also planning to start kf manufacturing india to start plasma products in india so that people can benefit from it we come together as one nation one planet one race samar swastha shantata prem ani sanmanane marathi bhashik samuday ekatraya kf manufacturing india che nirmiti suru karne chi yojna ahe bharatatil plasma utpadane jene karun lokanna tacha fayda hu shakel आपण एक राष्ट्र एक ग्रह आणि एक वंश म्हणून एकत्र यावेत फ्युचर
as one nation, one planet, one race, we come together with the universal community in harmony, peace, love, and respect. We extend our invitation to the universal community and start our exploration of universe with universal community. Ek rashtra, ek graha, and ek vansh manon upon universal samudai, susanwa, shanti, prem, and other ekatre alaur. Ame amcha amantra universal samudai, sati patato, and universal samudai, sa universe che, anvation praram bakarto. We are looking forward to hear from you. You see dot marathi at the red universal dot org. We are looking forward to hearing from you. UC. Marathi at Thank you. Can you hear me? Uh, there's a really bad echo, Ursula. You need to turn off your speakers or your uh, other microphone. Okay. So I will speak in Spanish, and you have to talk in in English. Can you get a bit closer to the microphone, perhaps? Yes. We start with the introduction. Can you hear me now, better? Um, it's not much different, but we can hear you. Me siento honrada de presentar nuestra enorme comunidad española la segunda lengua hablada en el mundo, que vienen de lejos, integrando el colorido conocimiento ancestral. ¿Quiénes somos? Somos la totalidad de nuestra conciencia y sabiduría heredada. Los mexicanos descienden de los mayas y de las culturas que siguieron, muchos otros descendiendo de los barcos durante múltiples ora, eh, olas de migración desde los conquistadores, pasando por la época de la esclavitud y al final escapando de las guerras. Todos conviviendo para componer lo que es hoy América Latina y España, diseminados en todo el mundo. Nuestra fuerza, fuerza interior permanece profundamente ligada a nuestros orígenes y todas las voces y culturas latinas se levantan para hacer resonar sus cantos basados en conocimientos ancestrales recuperados, conscientes de sus verdaderas identidades, encontrando el deseado reconocimiento para crecer en un nuevo mundo con abundancia y ser entendidos con todas sus maravillosas músicas y talentos. Experimentamos las variables desde lo antiguo a lo moderno, manteniendo el valor constante de nuestros verdaderos tesoros, integrando la ciencia en nuestras vidas con su fuente guiada desde nuestras almas. Next slide, please. Hemos estado presentes desde el primer taller de buscadores de conocimiento en el grupo de reactores y en los privados. Muchos cambios fueron apareciendo y la actitud latina, algunas veces rebelde, no nos ha desequilibrado, pero nunca nos rendimos. En 2016 asistí al primer encuentro de la comunidad universal en Roma, cuando he asumido la responsabilidad de la, de la comunidad española. Con orgullo he firmado el Tratado de Paz para nuestras 23 naciones. Nos sentimos más cerca del etos de la Fundación, compartiendo el conocimiento de esta Escuela del Alma y comenzamos a crear 
una nueva organización. Dos otros mayores se incorporaron para apoyar con constancia esa enorme misión de transmitir con devoción y las mejores intenciones compartiendo el conocimiento. Tratamos de unificar toda esa diversidad para muchos buscadores de conocimiento sin la traducción necesaria en ese tiempo. Tratamos de homogenizar todos los hermosos países que aportan mayormente a su manera, incluso hablando el mismo idioma español, confundiendo con múltiples páginas no oficiales y voces y etos. Hemos creado el año pasado el Oasis Provence, inspirado de Tom Salas, con algunos expertos y principiantes europeos, seis de Rumania y diez de España. Este ha sido un momento mágico, conociéndonos e intercambiando nuestro entendimiento juntos. Toda la información ha sido editada en el Plasma Times de julio 2019. Hemos organizado allí siete talleres en diversos ámbitos. Recibimos y disfrutamos de aprender juntos con buscadores de conocimiento de Alemania, Inglaterra, Francia y Argentina. Nos, reun nos reunimos en la, en la Conferencia de México el año pasado con más buscadores de conocimiento. En ese momento inició el coronavirus y el señor Keche ha estado presente en video, viendo las presentaciones de muchos buscadores de conocimiento que compartiremos en los próximos talleres de paz mundial, los martes. Tenemos muchos contactos y sus talentos serán incluidos para trabajar conjuntamente en las futuras comisiones que se llevarán a cabo. Next slide, please. The present. Hoy hemos evolucionado hacia una mejor organización y más clara comunicación. Nuestra página oficial del Facebook en español cuenta con más de 2.400 miembros y muchos están entrando cada día. Actualmente contamos con ciento, siete consejos universales, soporte, la mayoría de Argentina, México y de tres diferentes países con Colombia y Puerto Rico, que viven en Estados Unidos. Otros países están solicitando entrar, trayendo sus voces silenciosas del pasado para una mejor comprensión en sus propios países, como en Perú, Bolivia, Guatemala, Chile, Uruguay, y todos estarán presentes. Tenemos traducción simultánea todos los jueves, que puede ser escuchada ahora alrededor de toda la planeta, e integramos nuevos transcriptores para traducir la totalidad de los enseñamientos. Gracias a tantos y nuevos profesores experimentados que comparten sus conocimientos, incluyendo médicos, ingenieros, científicos, expertos en muchos temas como agricultura, apicultura, piscicultura, construcción, etc., se, convierte, se convierten en arquitectos del nuevo mundo, integrando la ciencia del plasma, comenzando a mostrar sus sorprendentes resultados. Somos más conscientes del poder de, nuestra, de nuestros deseos y de los, mejor, de los mensajes del alma, combinando a la mejor organización global de nuestra fundación y deseamos dar el ejemplo. Más de 150 buscadores de conocimiento asumieron la responsabilidad de una manera muy dinámica con el equipo de coronavirus eh, español en Telegram, superando más de 3.000 mensajes y muchos han, han encontrado respuestas y el apoyo necesario para las urgencias durante la devastadora pandemia, creando copas de vida para sus familias, amigos y comunidades. Tenemos dos nuevos anfitriones, un profesor y una terapeuta, que asumen con pasión sus nuevas responsabilidades, y nuestra Vicky fue una de las primeras y, y más avanzadas completando, son completadas ahora con información actuales conformes a la, al original y más globalizada. Damos dos talleres 
por semana. Los resultados positivos demuestran el interés de los empresarios para integrar esta tecnología en muchos ámbitos. Podemos compartir nuestra experiencia en todo el mundo. Muchos contactos gubernamentales están informados y informando a los administrados, empezando por la Ciudad de México, en el Senado y en el Congreso de Hidalgo. Muchos se inspiran de ese ejemplo para seguir el camino difundiendo en cada uno de los países y de los Pueblos Unidos. La verdad brilla en nuestros corazones latinos y nada puede detenernos ahora. Next slide, the future. El futuro es hoy. Estamos en una nueva dimensión del alma y de paz, apoyando a las nuevas generaciones para que sean fuertes y autónomas, gracias al conocimiento que nos brinda la Fundación. Todos los consejeros universales maduran para asumir sus propias responsabilidades y agrandar el círculo de jóvenes talentos. Los mayores estarán siempre presentes, apoyando e iniciando a todos los nuevos buscadores de conocimiento para que logren abrir sus alas y vuelen más, algo, más alto hacia el pasto. Viviendo con alegría, alcanzaremos nuestra deseada libertad para vivir en abundancia. Nuestra comunidad entrará en nuevas dimensiones gracias al contacto de sus almas conscientes de sus importantes misiones para la elevación planetaria. Un conocimiento más profundo en conciencia con más efectiva organización para obtener el acceso a más claridad. Gracias a los expertos y los, la experiencia de los pioneros y nuevos expertos, entraremos en el nuevo mundo que ya se abre ante nuestros ojos. Agradecidos de aprender cada vez más, orgullosos de todo lo realizado en el pasado y siendo fieles testigos del nuevo crecimiento que unificará todas esas hermosas culturas y diversos hechos. Next, please. Nuestra visión. Como creadores, somos donadores. Se avecinan grandes cambios. <coughs> Inmensas puertas se están abriendo. Estamos preparados para encaminarnos en las nuevas estrategias venideras y en la nueva organización con comunicación cada vez más clara, completa y accesible. Nuestro deseo es de elevar las almas, respetando la maravillosa biodiversidad natural y compartir las coloreadas culturas alrededor del mundo. Nuestra visión es de vivir todos juntos, creando una planeta, una nación, una raza, con todas las comunidades lingüísticas para integrar la comunidad universal. Para mí, miembro español del Consejo Universal, llegó el momento para invitar a una nueva generación de tomar las riendas, para que continuar el trabajo que ha cumplido con pasión, con todo mi tiempo, y el máximo esmero. Deseo seguir mi misión como Consejo Universal Soporte y trabajar estrechamente con los jóvenes talentos y expertos en ámbitos en los que deseo y puedo aportar mis conocimientos y experiencia para crear conjuntamente el nuevo mundo. Deseo continuar a profundizar mi conocimiento <coughs> ampliando y promoviendo la fundación que ha cambiado mi vida. Deseo apoyar mi comunidad española y las comunidades de todas las lenguas para crear puentes que se unan a todos los seres que sienten paz y convertirse en esa alma única que deseamos ser. <coughs> Gratitud al señor Meran Tabakonokeshi y a la señora Karina Kreshen por su constante paciente entrega de su conocimiento y tiempo para todos nosotros. Mi deseo es mi orden. Con toda mi alma y mi amor estoy presente. Gracias.
uh, maybe you could you could uh, transmit this translation in English when I was spoken, so it could be on the same time. Sorry, you want me to read this? Is that what you're saying? Um, I said uh, to Jamila that while I'm um, talking in Spanish, you can show this translation to make it shorter. Yes, yeah, so uh, have you already read this part? No, this is an English part. I read the Spanish part. And this could be present. But you read the Spanish of this part right yes, here. It's, it's exactly okay. the translation. Okay, I didn't know. Okay, we can go to the next slide then. But I can finish this one with my vision. The future is now. We will enter into new soul dimension of peace, supporting our new generation to be strong. All universal councils are mature now to take their own responsibilities and their elder will, their, will be better integrated with wisdom, will uh, support all new knowledge seekers to come up and open the wings and fly higher in the space, living with joy, reaching our wishes and our freedom to live in abundance and autonomy. We will always be uh, there and be present in their wishes of more and deeper knowledge. With all, all our background and experience, we can be grateful to learn from their upcoming, upcoming talents and from the young maturity, being proud of all we did in the past and witness the new growth unifying all those beautiful cultures and diversity. Diverse ethos. Next one, please. Vision. As creators, we are givers. Great changes are coming. Huge doors are opening. We are ready to move into future strategies and the new organization with clear and more accessible communication. Our wish is to elevate all souls, respecting their wonderful natural biodiversity and sharing the living and with colorful cultures around the world. Our vision is to live all together creating one planet, one nation, one race. With other languages, communities to integrate the universal community. For me, Spanish Universal Council member, the time has come to invite young Universal Council member to continue the work that I have accomplished with passion, with all my time and the maximum care. I wish to continue my mission as Universal Council support and to work closely with young talents and experts in the areas in which I can contribute my knowledge, my knowledge and my experience to create it, the new world all together. I wish to continue this and deeper, uh, deeper my, my knowledge, expanding and promoting the beloved foundation that has changed my life. I wish to support my Spanish community and communities of all languages to create big bridges to unify all beings who will feel peace to become that one soul that we wish to be. Gratitude to Mr. Kesh and Mr. Carolina, Mrs. Carolina for their constant and passion delivery of their knowledge and time to all of us. My wish is my command. With my soul and my love, I am present, Ursula.
Rick, you can continue until uh, Maltese language. Please. Thank you. This is still what, what I... Yeah, you already did it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, Rick, you can continue. Until uh, Maltese. Yeah, continue again. Stop here. Thank you. I am, my name is Emmanuel. I'm representing UC Maltese language. What have we done in the past? What are we presently doing? What are we doing, going to do in the future? Next slide, please. Malta, a neutral country, population 500,000. George Cross on the Maltese flag. This will remind us how much people suffered during World War II. Malta is the, in the middle of the Mediterranean Sea, a bridge between Africa and Europe. Next one. Peace Treaty is in our constitution. Malta's neutrality provisions are enshrined in Article 1, Number 3 of the Constitution, which reads as follows. Malta is a neutral state actively pursuing peace, security, and social progress amongst all nations by adhering to a policy of non-alignment and refusing to participate in any military alliance. What have we done in the past? Next one. I have been following Keshe Foundation since 2006. In 2007, I started informing the government and opposition members in the parliament about the Keshe against plasma technology. I also informed the health authorities about the Keshe Foundation Spaceship Institute teachings for doctors. I also informed the education department to include this technology in the curriculum. I also informed the environment department about these construction units to the teacher departments to eliminate the use of pesticides and fertilizers. In 2008, I wrote an article on a Maltese language newspaper about Keshe Foundation. I wrote an article on Sharaban Block about Naomi brought out of coma in three months. Keshe Foundation offered the government to reverse to cancer patients for free. Keshe Foundation offered the government to reverse two coma patients for free. So there were two offers two gifts. Keshe Foundations offered to share the seven-year cancer research with the University of Malta to work together against this, this disease. Next one. From 2016 to 2018, I taught Keshe Cairns Plasma Technology with success at St. Margaret's College Learning Support Center. The students were secondary boys students who manifest social, emotional, and behavior difficulties. Teachers also participated and learned the technology too. The students took part in a young scientist and technology exhibition, exhibition with GANS plasma application in agriculture at the Malta College of Arts, Science, and Technology, MCAS, in Paula. Keshe Foundation gave cans, breathing apparatus, and patches to doctors to help their patients to reverse their disease. In August 2018, Mr. M.T. Keshe met 
with the agriculture department officials to explain about the cash against plasma technology and offered against materials to test products. In August 2018, Mr. M. Tekeshi was interviewed about the GANS plasma technology by Malta National Television, TVM, and One TV. Next one. What are we presently doing? Next one, please. Okay. We are teaching and demonstrating in homes to make the one cup one life and cup two for prevention and reversal of the coronavirus. We translated instructions in the Maltese language to explain the, uh, how to make the, the two cups. We are supplying for free the cup one plasma water for prevention for those who cannot make the cups themselves. We are still making guns and patches to serve those in need. We managed to get approval by Malta Competition and Consumer and the First Authority, MCCAA, for KF products to be imported. We are discussing with MCAST, Gateway to Industry, about the training facilities. On the 24th, 25th, and 26th of this January, 2020, we organized a scientific and investment conference for government ministries, permanent secretaries, ambassadors, and scientists. We can be contacted on Telegram, Keshe Malta Corona team, to serve. Next one, please. What are we going to do in the future? We will continue producing GANs of the two caps. We, we have stock of GANs and amino acid for future use. We continue to contact industry and inform them about the Keshe GANS plasma technology. We are working with Keshe Foundation to set the base in Malta. We have a distributor for Keshe GANS plasma technology products. We are working with Keshe Foundation to apply for an industrial zone with factories to produce Keshe GANS plasma products to be able to, be, to distribute worldwide. This will help our nation diversity diversify, diversify its economy. Next one. We continue to serve. Okay, we will exchange the technology for peace. We will continue to serve and not to be served. We will use the Keshe Foundation Spaceship Institute teachings. We will use the Keshe GANS plasma technology in GANS and, and Nano. We will use the Keshe GANS plasma technology in agriculture and food. We will use the Keshe GANS plasma technology in energy and telecommunications. We will use the cash against plasma technology in national security and health. We will use the cash against plasma technology in transportation. We will use the cash against plasma technology in water and environment. We will use the cash against plasma in emotion and soul. We will use our soul to give to other souls to, to take what they need. Thank you. Peace be with you. Now, uh, we continue in Maltese, please. Next one. You see lingua Maltia. Shamina fil passat. Shedin nam lo palessa. Shenam lo fil futur. Next one. Malta Pais neutrali. Popolazioni Hames Mittelf. George Cross for Bandera Maltia. Tani fakarna kem sofreu nis wa tittini kwerra dinia. Malta tin sap nof stal bahar mediterran. Pont bel l'Africa o l'Europa. Next one. It trattat ta paci in safr konstitucioni tana. It dispozizioni ta neutralita ta Malta o ma min uxa fl artiklu wihet numru tlita ta konstitucioni le aitek. Malta ia stat neutrali li et te segui b'mot atti fil paci e sigurta u l-progress sociali fosti nazjoni it kolla billi ja derixi ma politika tanu asta allineament u billi rifjuta i partecipa f'kull l-alleanza militari. Next one. Xa minna fil passat. Next one. In the second foundation, which is from 2006, from 2006, from 
ninforma li l-membri tal-gvern u tal-oppozizzjoni fil-parlament dwar il-kexegans plasma teknoloġi. Jena raft u koll l-autoritajiet tal-saħa dwar il-talim tal-Keshe Foundation Spaceship Institute għat-tobba. Għaraft u koll il-Departament tal-Edukazzjoni biex inkludi din il-teknoloġija fil-kurrikulu. Għaraft u koll il-Departament tal-Ambjent dwar kits ta' estrazzjoni ta' CO2 mill-arja biex itnaqqas il-global warming. Għaraft il-Departament tal-Agrikoltura dwar l-użu tal-gens biex iġi eliminat l-użu tal-pesticidi u fertilizzanti. Fil-2008 aktib tal-artiklu fuq gazzetta lokali bil-lingwa Maltija dwar il-fondazzjoni keġe. Jinktib tal artiklu kol fuq xara bank blok dwar għara tlex ċut u min koma. Il-fondazzjoni keġe offrit bxejn li għven bxi redġa l-ura zewx pazjenti tal-kanser bluzu ta' din il-teknoloġija. Il-fondazzjoni keġe offrit ul li għven bxi redġa l-ura zewx pazjenti tal-koma bluzu ta' din il-teknoloġija. Il-fundazzjoni kexi offrit li taqsam seba snin ta' riċerka tal-kanser li l-Universita ta' Malta biex naħtmu flimkien kontra din il-marda. Next one. Mill-2016 sal-2018 għamilt teknoloġija għallimt teknoloġija plasma għens ta' kexi suċċess fiċċentru ta' l-appoċ ta' t-talim tal-kollet Santa Margarita. L-studenti kienu studenti subin ta' sekundari li juru difficultajt soċiali, emozjonali u ta' mġiba. L-allima partiċipaw u kollu ta' l-muteknoloġija. L-studenti għadu sem furja xientist za' zahu teknoloġija bl-applikazzjon ta' gens plasma fil-agrikoltura fil-kollex ta' l-emkaz fraħġdid. Il-fondazzjoni keċe ta' ta' parat ta' nifs il-ma u plasma u għarza li t-tobba biex jajnu li l-pazjenti taħħu biex jirreġġuru għura l-marda taħħu. Fawissu l-2018 s-sur emti keċi l-taqa ma' uffiċjal li tal-Departement tal-Ugrultura biex jispegaw dwar il-teknoloġija plasma għans ta' keċi u għafrew materiali għans biex jittestjaw il-prodotti. Fawissu l-2018 s-sur emti keċi għi intervista dwar għans Plasma Technology min Xandir Malta u One TV. Next one. Xiet namlu palissa. Next one. Aħna nalmu u nuru vidjar kif jamlu tazzi numru wijhet u tazza numru tnejn għal-prevenzjoni u tredġiħ l-ura tal-koronavirus. Aħna għet niprovdu bxejn il-ma ta' tazza numru wijhet tal-plazma għal-prevenzjoni u għaddaq li ma jistaw xiamlu l-tazza u huma stess. Aħna għetnamlu għens u għarza biex naħdu l-dawk fil-bżon. Aħna għnexin nanġibu l-approvazzjoni mill-autorita ta' Malta għal-kompetizzjoni u l-konsumatur u l-affarijiet MCCAA biex il-prodotti tal-plazma jiġu importati. Għetni diskutu mal-MCAST, Gateway to Industry, dwar il-faċilitajiet, faċilitajiet ta' taħriċ, għall-studenti, jo għaddijema l-l-quddim jistawiġu impiegati. Fl-24, 25 u 26 jannar 2020, organizzajna konferenza xientifika u ta' investiment għal-ministri tal-kven, segretari parlamentari, ambaxaturi u xienzati. Tista tu kontatjana fuq Telegram keċe Malta Koronati. Next one, please. Xiet namlu għal-futur. Aħna nkomplu nikkontatjaw lill-industrialista u ninformaw mdwar il-keġe għans plasma technology biġi kun jistaw jizvoluppaw u maħgol. Eddin naħdnu mal-fondazzjoni keċe għabiġi waqfu l-bazi f-Malta għanna distributur għal-prodotti tal-teknoloġija tal-plasma għans. Eddin naħdnu mal-fondazzjoni keċe biġi n-applikaw għal-zona industriali fabriki li jiproduċu għans plasma products biex jikun tistat għassam maddinja kolla. Danja jajn li l-nazjon taħna jiddersifika l-ekonomija tijaw. Next one. Aħna se nkom, aħna se niskambjaw il-teknoloġija ġdida għal-paġi.
احنا نكونوا نهضموا نقدو مش باش نكونوا مؤديه احنا نزود التعليم تاع الكشف فاونديشن سبيس انستيتيوت احنا نزود تكنولوجيا بلازما جانس تاع كشف كانس ونانو احنا نزود تكنولوجيا بلازما جانس تاع كشف في الاكولتورا والكل احنا نزود تكنولوجيا تاع بلازما جانس تاع كشف الانرجيا تيليكومونيكاسيون احنا نزود تكنولوجيا بلازما جانس تاع كشف السيكورتا ناسيونالي والصحه احنا نزود تكنولوجيا بلازما جانس تاع كشف في الترانسبورت احنا نزود تكنولوجيا بلازما جانس تاع كشف في الماء والامبيانت احنا نزود تكنولوجيا بلازما جانس تاع كشف في الموتسيوني والروح احنا نزود الروح تاعنا باش نعطوا للاروي اخرى باش يدوا داك اللي عندهم زون جراتسي والباجي معكم ثانك يو Hello, can you hear me? Yes, go ahead. Yeah. Hello, my name is Marie. I'm Universal Council member for the Norwegian language and will present the Nordic team. Uh, the Nordic team is located in the north of Europe. And in this presentation, Danish and Norwegian languages are present. But there are space for many more languages in the Nordic team. If you want to be part of the Nordic team, you can use Telegram, where there's, there is an emergency group for Corona for the Nordic languages. The group is called Kesha Nordic Corona Group. Now, Kesha Nordic Corona Team. Here you can get support and help in making the One Cup One Life and get in contact with local knowledge seekers in your language. On Facebook, we have Kesha Foundation groups for the Swedish language, the Danish language, and the Norwegian language. You can also apply to become a Universal Council supporter or a Universal Council member for your language. We welcome you to the Nordic team and as a member in the ever growing Kesha Foundation family. Next, please. Norway uh, is, has a population of 5 million citizens and the biggest industries are petroleum, natural gas, fishing, aquaculture and fertilizers for agriculture and weapons. Norway has beautiful nature and the tourist industry is growing. The first corona wave seems to have passed in Norway. Schools are opening again and life is slowly returning back to normal after lockdown. Next, please. The Norwegian, I think there is another, you have to click one more. Next, please. Uh, the Norwegian community had plasma teachings in the Norwegian language a couple of years ago. Unfortunately, they are not running, but uh, we'll, we will try to get them up back. We also uh, has been facilitating soul teachings in the private school in the KFSSI. The teachings about the soul is in the center of the plasma teachings and necessary to understand our own being, our creation and existence, who we are and who, how the universe is creating, created and operating. And it's necessary to understand and create world peace. Our team did preparation for the corona pandemic by creating information in Norwegian and giveaway kits of the one cup, one life, and so on. Next, please. I think you have to take one more. The Norwegian team is active in the private school in 
FSSI and in the Universal Council. We are a small group and we welcome any new knowledge seekers from our region. Next, please. My wish is that anyone speaking Norwegian and who is interested in what we are doing in Kesha Foundation and the Universal Council will get in contact with us and join our team. By doing so, we will create peace and prosperity for all and eventually become united with our brothers and sisters in the Universal community as equal members. You can use this email address or, con or contact members of your language by joining one of our channels on Facebook or Telegram. And then some words in Norwegian. Mitt ønske er at alle som er interessert i å høre mer om plasmateknologiens løsninger på verdens utfordringer innenfor helse, energi, miljøforrensning, sult og så videre, samt det viktige arbeidet med å skape en fredfull og rettferdig verden for alle, ta kontakt med det norske teamet i Cash Foundation og The Universal Council. Jeg inviterer også mitt ønske om å gi fra min sjel til alle sjeler i skapelsen, og mitt ønske er min kommando. Thank you, Mr. Cash, for bringing this technology of the universe to humanity. Thank you. Tusen takk, og thank you all for listening. Thank you. Thank you, Marie. Uh, this is uh, Pia here from the UC Danish language. And you can go to the next slide, Rick. Uh, I just start to say that in Denmark, uh, we have a population feature of uh, nearly 6 million people. And um, Denmark is known for its tradition in agriculture production and wind turbines. And lately the Danish wind turbines produce twice as much electricity as all Danish solar cells and power plants combined. And wind turbines energy um, is the leading technology that supplies the Danes with electricity combined with imports of electricity from our neighboring countries. Just to say so, a little bit about Denmark, but uh, it's plasma technology we are here for now. And at the moment, I say like um, Marie, we are only a little community here in Denmark. Very few people right now working with the plasma technology. We don't know actually how many. But uh, plasma energy is working um, natural, like natural field energy, field energy, uh, and it works in very good ways. So, um, especially because we link up with uh, all the knowledge seekers from all over the planet. And uh, we see that the new openings are happening everywhere. Uh, it's a new awareness that uh, are ready to show up in different ways, uh, also here in North and in Denmark, like uh, anywhere else on the planet right now. So that we can see it now because generally we see families and schools and school classes, students, individuals, they're going out to do what they can. There's so many people who are starting getting aware especially in this uh, corona crisis here, it's people starting um, seeing something, it's very clear to see. They are learning uh, more about the environment in the schools and they are more aware of what we have done to our nature and the urgent need to do something about it. Yeah, and it's not tomorrow, but it's now. And uh, I would actually like to read this and uh, talk this, speak this in Danish also, before we go to the next slide. So I say here, 
Vi har jo i Danmark et befolkningstal på næsten 6 millioner mennesker, og vi er jo kendt for vores tradition inden for landbrugsproduktion og vindmøller. For nylig der producerede de danske vindmøller dobbelt så meget elektricitet som alle danske kraftværker til sammen. Så vindmølleenergi og sammen med solceller, det er jo den teknologi, vi har lige nu, der forsyner danskerne med elektricitet kombineret med import af elektricitet fra vores nabolande. Så i øjeblikket der er vi ikke klar over, hvor mange der arbejder med plasmateknologi i Danmark. Men plasmateknologien fungerer alligevel godt øh, som naturlig felt energi på mange forskellige gode måder. Især fordi vi gennem plasmafelterne, vi er linket op med alle de andre knowledge seekers over hele planeten. Og der er nye åbninger i gang overalt. Der er en ny bevidsthed, der er i gang, øh, og det viser sig på mange forskellige måder, også her i Norden og i Danmark, ligesom alle mulige andre steder på, på kloden. Så generelt der ser vi nu, at familier og skoleklasser og studerende, enkelte personer, og der er rigtig mange, der simpelthen gør, hvad de kan for at gøre en forskel. Det er, det er meget tydeligt at se, at det er ligesom en bølge, der, der er i gang i vores land. Og vi lærer mere om miljøet, og vi er meget mere opmærksomme på, hvor forurenet vores natur er, og hvor vigtigt det er med sund trivsel for miljøet og dyr og os selv, og alle væsener i det hele taget. Så generelt så ser vi, at det er det, der sker her. Så de fleste de er klar over, at vi har et presserende og et akut behov for at gøre noget ved det, og det er ikke noget, der skal ske i morgen eller om noget tid, men det er noget, der skal ske nu. Der er brug for, at vi gør noget nu. Please go to the next slide, Rick. New knowledge. Even our government are working so hard now to find new solutions. They work hard, very hard. And uh, because they know they have to. And children, schools and families, they go to beaches and they collect garbage. Uh, they're working with new ideas for nature and experiments in the classes. They do all this together from what they have learned so far. And our government is supporting and encouraging us all to do so. And then imagine and visualize what will happen when everyone are informed about what is now happening worldwide with the GANS and plasma technology. And we all are in actions with projects together with the new plasma solutions, building the cups, cleaning up the streets with spraying the plasma waters and cleaning up our environment and our own health for our own safety in the coronavirus time and in every virus time actually and we learn more and we study more and all together we are making a major difference in the new transformations that are happening i read this in danish too uh, selv selv vores regering arbejder rigtig hårdt nu for at finde løsninger og de arbejder endda meget hårdt på det fordi de ved godt at de er nødt til det her og nu der skal nogle løsninger til. Og børn og skoler og familier, de tager nu til stranden og på gader og indsamler skrald. De arbejder i skoleklassen med nye idéer og eksperimenter for at hjælpe naturen og vores miljø. De gør det alt sammen ud fra det, de har lært indtil nu. Og vores regering støtter og opfordrer dem til at arbejde med det. Prøv at forestille jer, hvad der vil ske når alle bliver informeret om det, der lige nu sker i hele verden med GANS og plasmateknologi, teknologi, hvor vi arbejder sammen i projekter med nye løsninger med plasma og GANS teknologien. Folk kan bygge deres egen cup of life. De kan rense op i gaderne med at spraye plasmavandet, der renser op i vores miljø og vores helbred, vores sikkerhed, og vi kan lære mere og vi kan studere mere, og sammen der kan vi gøre en stor forskel her midt i de nye forandringer, der sker. Det er os alle sammen, der kan være med til at gøre noget øh, sammen med den her teknologi. Next slide, please.
New opening. With one of the corona cases uh, we have experienced here in Denmark, uh, there we applied the cup of life. And this was just one beginning experience. And this experience started an opening that more people now are asking and are interested in to learn more about the cup of life and to receive the cup of life. They ask now for the material kits to build the cups themselves. And in this, they also learn more about how to apply. And already now they are learning others about the plasma technology, like we see in so, that so many people and families already are doing all around the world. In Danish, new opening. I en af coronatilfældene, der har vi oplevet her i Danmark, at vi anvendte The Cup of Life, og det var kun starten på det hele. Denne oplevelse det startede en åbning, hvor flere mennesker nu efterspørger The Cup of Life og er interesseret. De beder nu om kits til at bygge Cup of Life selv, og i det lærer de også mere om plasma og gansteknologien, og de kan give det videre til andre. Og det vi ser nu, det er, at der er mange tusinder mennesker og familier, der allerede er i gang med teknologien på verdensplan. Next slide. Information to the government. Uh, we have been informing the Danish government regularly about the new releases from Kiss Foundation uh, since the beginning of the Spaceship Institute opening. Until now, we have informed about also especially new about the new agriculture applications development of the plasma and GANS technology. And we have also informed about the trials uh, regarding the successful trials and saving of more than 700 pigs in the swine flu epidemic in China. And since the corona situation started, our prime minister and government have been informed with videos and wiki links about the one cup, one life and new possibilities for the application to help people and hospitals to apply and eradicate the coronavirus. We have got polite responses from the Danish government. So uh, just because they have not responded with much uh, communication for now, uh, they can still get on board because we can act and we can attract with our intentions, actions and wishes. På dansk her. Information til den danske regering. Vi har informeret den danske regering øh, om de nye udviklinger og offentliggør for Cash Foundation siden begyndelsen af Spaceship Institutets åbning. Og senest har vi informeret blandt andet om de nye applikationer til landbrugsmetoder inden for plasma og gansteknologien. Og vi har øh, offentliggjort, eller de har offentliggjort informationer om vellykket forsøg i forhold til landbruget øh, i flere lande, blandt andet Kina, men også mange andre lande i Kenya. Øhm, og vi har også fået informationer om virus øh, svine under svineinfluenzaepidemien for i år, hvor de redde mere end 7, 2, nej, 7, sorry, 700 svin i svineinfluenzaepidemien i Kina. Og det var Kess Foundation og Gans Teknologien, der var øh, involveret i det forsøg. Så siden øh, coronavirusen begyndte, der er vores statsminister og sundhedsministeriet og forskere, de er blevet informeret med videoer og wikilinks om One Cup One Life og de nye muligheder for applikationen, der hjælper folk i mange hjem og på hospitaler i Iran og Kina med at overkomme coronavirus. Og vi har fået høflige svar fra den danske regering, så bare fordi de ikke har reageret med yderligere kommunikation på vores invitation til møder, så kan de stadig nå at komme med ombord. Og vi kan alle handle, og det er det vi gør, med vores stærke intentioner og handlinger og ønsker. Next slide, please. We are moving forward. Millions of people all around the planet are getting on board. 
So we are moving forward. We are moving forward. And we have now in Denmark also encouraged researchers and universities to test and look more into the Iranian example of the successful cleanup of cities and hospitals, where cities and hospitals now is free of the coronavirus. This is what ha what's happening in Iran and in many places in China. So we have to start to open the doors like Iranian, Brazilian, Spanish and Chinese teams have already done for citizens and cities to eradicate the coronavirus. With a new fresh direction, we also have to move on now to bring our school environments and knowledge about peace and balance, we have to bring it a step up to update how to thrive on a deeper level with new tools to work with each other in an inspiring way. We have to understand and learn more about our inherent potential by bringing the new knowledge and tools for new developments to open up to the beautiful inherent culture we have from inside. We are the natural human beings in the creation we originate from. And we create our own present and future. And we can all join in our daily lives in fellow and global and local education and projects to create well being, education, prosperity, joy, and balanced development for everyone. In Danish. Millions of people, millioner af mennesker over hele planeten er i gang, så vi går videre under alle omstændigheder. Og det kan vi også gøre her i Danmark. Vi kan gå med og gå med i denne her udvikling. Og vi vil også opfordre forskere i Danmark og universiteter til at teste og se nærmere på de iranske eksempler på vellykkede tilfælde, vi ser nu, hvor byer og hospitaler er nu helt fri af coronavirus. Så vi er nødt til at begynde at åbne dørene, ligesom de iranske og brasilianske og kinesiske hold allerede har gjort for deres borgere og byer i forhold til at udrydde coronavirusen. Så med en frisk tilgang og retning, der er vi også nødt til at gå videre nu med at bringe vores skolemiljø og viden om, hvordan vi kan skabe fred og balance. Vi kan skabe det til et nyt skridt fremad. For vi må opdatere hele vores skolesystem hvordan vi kan trives bedre på et dybere niveau med nye redskaber, hvor vi kan arbejde sammen med hinanden på en inspirerende måde. Vi har langt større muligheder for at forstå og lære mere om vores iboende potentiale ved at bringe ny viden med universel viden, og med nye initiativer, der kan vi åbne vores smukke iboende egenskaber som mennesker. Vi er de naturlige mennesker i den skabelse, vi selv stammer fra. Vi skaber vores egen nutid og fremtid, og vi kan alle deltage i vores daglige liv i global og lokal videreuddannelse og projekter, der skaber trivsel og viden, velstand, glæde og afbalanceret udvikling for alle. Og det er noget af det, GANS og plasmateknologien kan gøre. Next slide, thank you. We give. We want to thank you, Mr. Kesh and Carolina, uh, for all what you're doing. And we thank the Iranian and Chinese, Brazilian and Spanish teams and all the Kesh Foundation teams and knowledge seekers around the planet for all the work you have done so far in showing us the good examples for the new movements. I'm grateful to be here and I really want to thank you. And we have now the opportunity, all of us, to participate. Families, children, students, education platforms and business to learn more about the Cash Plasma technology. And we can jointly be together in cleaning up our planet to build the systems and spray our streets, our homes and ourselves. And we just do it because we are ready. And so many people on the planet are moving forward. We can see it everywhere. And we do it now. 
We are billions of beings in action and in spirit. We are creating the peace. We unite with the voices of the nation languages and we are creating everlasting peace, cooperation, positive development for all living being in existence. I give freely from my soul to all souls in existence. Take what you need, I'm present. From the Universal Council. I am present. Are there other who want to say they're present? They I, am present. I 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 am present. And I am present on behalf of the core team. Thank you. Did you want to do that part in uh, uh, Danish as well? Yes, I can do that. Vi giver. Vi takker jer, Maran Kish and Carolina. Og vi takker de iranske og kinesiske og brasilianske hold og alle Kish Foundation teams og knowledge seekers rundt omkring i verden for alt det arbejde, I har gjort indtil nu. Og I viser de gode eksempler på de nye bevægelser og den nye viden om plasma og gans teknologi. Vi har nu muligheden for os alle at deltage. Det er så let at gå til familier, børn, studerende, uddannelsesplatforme og virksomheder. Og vi kan erfare mere om cash, plasma og teknologi, og vi kan gå sammen om at rense op vores planet og opbygge nye systemer, sprede vores skader hjem og os selv med, den rensende, med det rensende plasmavand. Og vi gør det bare, fordi vi allerede er i gang. Fordi der er så mange mennesker på planeten, der bevæger sig fremad nu, og vi gør det nu. Og vi er milliarder af væsener i handling og i ånd, der skaber fred. Vi er forenet i stemmerne fra nationernes sprog. Vi skaber evig fred, samarbejde og positiv udvikling for alle levende væsener i eksistensen. Vi giver frit for vores sjæle til alle sjæle i eksistensen. Tag imod det, du har brug for. Vi er til stede. Tak. Thank you. Very much. Okay, I believe we have the UC Italian language next. Yes, uh, good evening, good afternoon, good morning, uh, wherever you are. <laughs> um, I would... Uh, uh, un secondo. Yes, see. Um, I, I would uh, say something in English first. And then, uh, Rick, if you like, uh, you can uh, uh, play the, the video and... Um, and uh, it's going to be in Italian. So I'm going to, do, I'm going to say something in English, just introduction uh, in, uh, sorry, in Italian first, uh, um, and then uh, play the videos, and then I will uh, do a summary in, in English, if it's okay for you. So um, my name is Stefania, and uh, I am uh, represent uh, uh, the uh, Universal Council for Italy. Il mio nome è Stefania Daddetta, e io rappresento il Consiglio Universale per l'Italia e il mio, uh, la, il mio uh, intenzione è di servire, e di servire la nazione italiana e, e anche di portare la pace, con la visione di portare la pace nel mondo. 
Adesso presenteremo una, uh, un video dove faremo vedere eh, la nostra visione uh, del futuro, e, però inizieremo col passato, quindi faremo vedere quello che per noi era l'Italia prima del corona, uh, poi del presente, uh, quello che per noi è il corona, uh, quello che ha portato il corona e quello, i cambiamenti che ha portato anche il corona, e poi il futuro, la nostra visione del futuro. Abbiamo messo insieme uh, foto del, del, nostri, del nostro team, team italiano, dei ricercatori di sapienza italiani. Uh, il team italiano uh, è un team molto, molto, molto bello. Ci siamo messi tutti quanti insieme con l'intenzione di portare la pace nel mondo e uh, insieme con l'aiuto uh, reciproco l'uno con l'altro Uh, cercando di uh, fare quello che po poteva, potevamo fare al nostro meglio per dare un supporto uh, alla nazione in questa transizione. Uh, abbiamo avuto la fortuna di creare un, un team uh, di persone che insieme uh, si sono distribuiti i ruoli per condividere il sapere e per uh, condividere il sapere della tecnologia cash, della tecnologia plasmatica che il dottor Cash ci ha, uh, sta condividendo con noi uh, già da, molto, da molti anni uh, con, la, con la visione di portare la pace nel mondo e, mh, e piano piano anche l'Italia è riuscita a, 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 a sapere di questa tecnologia e nel nostro meglio la stiamo uh, cercando di, di, di divulgarla a più persone possibili non solo in Italia ma anche nella, nel mondo, uh, con la visione di portare la pace nel mondo e di avere una nazione e una razza, tutti insieme. Questo è arrivato il momento per metterci tutti quanti insieme e lavorare insieme per fare questi cambiamenti che abbiamo sempre eh, desiderato. E quindi noi come squadra italiana Uh, ci siamo, abbiamo cominciato a produrre uh, in grosse quantità uh, la coppa numero uno, la coppa numero due, grazie anche a persone molto molto speciali um, um, e che hanno, e mi riferisco magari anche come per esempio Ivo Lara, che loro uh, hanno anche prima uh, del, del coronavirus, uh, hanno Uh, hanno cominciato a fare corsi, a riorganizzare gruppi, a fare seminari uh, e nel loro meglio a, div a divulgare questa, questa uh, tecnologia negli ultimi anni. E, con l'arrivo del coronavirus um, ci siamo anche più unificati e abbiamo cominciato a fare squadre di emergenza la squadra di emergenza italiana come ci sono in tutte le altre nazioni. Eh, la, tecnologia, la, la Cash Foundation ha fatto uh, appena uh, è arrivata questa epidemia dalla, dalla Cina. La Cash Foundation, come al solito, ha cercato di trovare soluzioni a problematiche per l'umanità, uh, divulgando questa tecnologia gratuitamente e con l'unico desiderio che se uh, la impariamo in maniera gratuita, dobbiamo div divulgarla in maniera gratuita. Almeno a 10 persone. E se ognuno di noi la divulga a 10 persone, in poco tempo abbiamo coperto tutta la uh, superficie del, del pianeta. E, questa tecnologia è molto molto facile da usare. Eh, può essere applicata da tutti a poco prezzo, anche a, a niente, con le cose che uno ha in casa. Casale, per, una, per la prima volta casalinghe, elettricisti, uh, mh, tutti, non, indipendentemente, dalla, indipendentemente dalla, dal, dal sapere, dall'istruzione, dalla scuola, anche le persone più semplici, anche le persone... Non importa se sei stato a scuola oppure no, che educazione hai, anche i bambini. Tutti hanno, con la tecnologia cash, 
del plasma eh, possono eh, diventare essere scienziati e portare in maniera concreta un cambiamento non solo a livello individuale per se stessi, ma anche in tutto il mondo, insieme. Per la prima volta ci è stata, stata data l'opportunità di lavorare insieme come un'unica famiglia, un'unica nazione per portare la pace nel mondo e per dare un nuovo inizio. E quindi la, il team italiano, nel suo piccolo, come in tutti i team in tutto il mondo, hanno creato dei gruppi di emergenza eh, con Telegram, Facebook, usando tutti i social media disponibili in questo momento per portare questo cambiamento. È arrivato l'ora di eh, non soffrire e di gioire finalmente quello che ci è stato dato. E quindi ehm, abbiamo incominciato tutti insieme, parlo della squadra italiana, a fare gruppi, gruppi regionali, eh, gruppi mh, regionali per, in questo modo per dare un supporto a, dalla nazione all'individuo, per dare un supporto a tutti in modo equo e gratuito per dare un supporto nelle, nei momenti di difficoltà, come in questo momento con il coronavirus. E eh, abbiamo anche, eh, ognuno di noi, chi poteva, ha dato la disposizione del suo tempo, della sua vita, perché noi siamo qua per servire e non essere serviti, alla produzione di, della, della coppa numero uno, coppa numero due che è la Coppa per la vita. Coppa per la vita perché salva vite e crea. Quindi per la prima volta abbiamo avuto, uh, grazie a Tecnologia Cash, e a Mr. Cash e alla Cash Foundation e al loro duro lavoro, da ormai io ho conosciuto Cash dieci anni fa, anzi un po' di più di dieci anni fa, e da quando l'ho conosciuto lui ha sempre lavorato duramente, senza fermarsi, per portare questa visione della pace del mondo. E piano piano per magia si è formata la Cash Foundation e piano piano per magia tutti quanti hanno cominciato a sentire, eh, a imparare questa, questo sapere. E insieme abbiamo formato la Cash Foundation in tutto il mondo now, adesso e la divulghiamo gratuitamente in YouTube ogni settimana, senza mancare una settimana. Il giovedì Mr. Cash presenta lui di persona e condivide liberamente questa tecnologia e tutti sono, sono invitati uh, a essere presenti. Nuovi studenti, vecchi studenti, tutti, bambini, donne, non dipende che razza, non dipende che colore, ognuno si può collegare a YouTube o, tele, o a Facebook o Zoom o live stream e può sentire e imparare questa tecnologia a costo zero e a parlare direttamente con Cash, a fare domande e risposte. Poi gli studenti passati o chi ha cominciato a conoscere Cash hanno cominciato a, a formare la Cash Foundation e lì trovate informazioni su Wikipedia, e trovate informazioni di testimonianze trovate eh, reporti scientifici e quindi qui dottori, scienziati, gente comune scrive le loro esperienze, le loro testimonianze 
per divulgare ancora di più questa, questa, questo knowledge che ci è stato dato gratuitamente per portare la pace nel mondo. E adesso vi faremo vedere questo video um, che abbiamo fatto pre-corona, che è il passato, che è il passato dove c'era una... Uh, dove abbiamo iniziato con... Uh, la sopravvivenza della razza umana e abbiamo iniziato con, uh, con la divisione, con l'agricoltura, con il cominciare a separarci l'uno dall'altro e uh, a portare divisione, divisione e competizione, inuguaglianza, guerre, povertà, fame, morti. Sofferenza, inquinamento, vittimismo. E questo è il passato, dove non c'è responsabilità e dove sempre ci sentiamo impotenti. E poi c'è il presente. Il presente, faremo vedere il, il presente, che il presente è arrivato con, uh, come stiamo facendo adesso, il lockdown. Uh, col coronavirus che il coronavirus ha portato a paura ancora più paura confusione e poi ha portato morte disperazione e poi c'è la luce sempre nel presente dove stando tutti quanti chiusi in casa perché non potevamo più uscire abbiamo incominciato abbiamo, abbiamo avuto più tempo per studiare per unirci per capire eh, perché siamo qua Qual è la nostra missione? Perché siamo qua sulla Terra? E così abbiamo incominciato, facciamo, faremo vedere le foto che noi eh, facciamo foto, abbiamo fatto foto per vedere che abbiamo cominciato dalla paura a, a veramente la Cash Foundation con, a, dando questa soluzione di una coppa, una vita che la gente poteva fare a casa con pochi soldi. C'è stata una, divulg una divulgazione molto molto più accelerata. Infatti il coronavirus è diventato una cosa positiva, nel senso che ha portato le, le persone più unite perché eh, soprattutto la tecnologia cash ha dato la speranza, la speranza eh, di una vita nuova. E infatti con, uh, abbiamo cominciato a fare gruppi, come dicevo, di emergenza, a, a dare supporto a chi stava poco bene e non poteva essere sostenuto in momenti di difficoltà. Abbiamo insegnato le coppe, uh, abbiamo anche noi tradotto uh, su Wikipedia, anche nel, abbiamo, abbiamo creato una piattaforma pubblica italiana dove lì ci ha spiegato la coppa numero uno, la coppa numero due, la coppa numero tre e i protocolli per chi la vuole vedere gratuitamente su YouTube. Abbiamo fatto, come dicevo, gruppi regionali per sostenere le persone in, in regione e per unirci, per, per scambiarci eh, i prodotti, com di come fare la coppa, o informazioni, o, o, o spedircele l'uno all'altro. E, e questo è il presente. Questo presente, e, e allo stesso momento adesso stiamo vedendo il risveglio. Adesso abbiamo capito con le nostre esperienze, con le nostre testimonianze, che Mr. Cash, la tecnologia Cash, può dare soluzioni non soltanto a livello del coronavirus, ma può dare soluzioni anche a livello di salute, di ambiente, ehm, energia. Praticamente possiamo risolvere qualsiasi problema che abbiamo avuto fino adesso in maniera equa e in maniera molto solidale, a poco prezzo, lavorando tutti insieme, aiutandoci l'uno con l'altro in modo equo. Non c'è uno più alto, uno più basso. E eh, scambiamo i nostri, i nostri saperi. E ritornando così alle origini di come mai siamo qua, e quindi il futuro è diventato molto più, più bello. E quindi eh, siamo in questo momento di transizione, in questo switch, dove il, il futuro, l'abbiamo messo in questo video, dove lo vediamo come un futuro bellissimo, 
dell'abbondanza, dell'uguaglianza, dell della fratellanza, della cooperazione, dove la gente coopera l'uno con l'altro e fa magie. E insieme, dove eh, il governo incomincia a capire che deve rappresentare la gente e quindi comincia a dare un supporto, questa è la nostra visione, che il governo comincia a dare un supporto a tutti per modo sì che tutti i beni sono, sono del mangiare, del sopravvivere, sono stati esauriti e la gente si può dedicare alle cose che più ama per una crescita e per un'evoluzione in un mondo migliore. E la tecnologia cash non solo ci aiuta su questo, ma anche ci accelera questo passaggio e questa unione con la comunità universale. E infatti abbiamo condiviso nel futuro, nel video futuro, le foto del leone e della, della pecora, degli animali che vivono in pace insieme e, del, e della comunità universale. Adesso vi faccio vedere il video. Ok, Chris, se uh, Rick, se vuoi like to show il video, thank you. Uh, you want the video played now? Yeah, thank you. Yes. So this was all the present. So I showed all the, um, sorry, it was all the past, sorry. It was all the past before. The pollution, disruption. This is the present, so people start to um, uh, know about the corona and get protection. The lockdown starting and death, deaths. Thank you. 
and people uh, having time to stay home and get together and gather in knowledge and study. And here, the cash technology really spread really fast because uh, it was uh, a solution to this uh, corona problem. Uh, we woke up one life because uh, we collecting studies, especially in Italy, where people, including myself, uh, where I was affected by the corona, and uh, I used the one cup and one life to um, recovering from the virus, thanks to Mr. Cash and Caroline and the Cash Technology, the Cash Foundation. They gave me the full support from day one. And thanks to, to them that I'm here today. So here we show all the people getting together and uh, make the cup and uh, spread the knowledge. And here we see the future also coming up where we see the whole world getting together in these difficult times and start to learn about the cash technology making a um, um, workshop freely and uh, Sunday, it's been taught to us freely. So, so if you teach freely, uh, only one thing was required to taught to you freely, you teach too freely to 10 people, you can cover the whole world in no time. And here you can see the, um, uh, the Italian team getting action, also making soaps. <laughs> this is the future where you start to use uh, the cash technology to solve all different problems and, and uh, apply in a different, different application. So we're getting together to spread the knowledge. And these are our wish. I give freely from my soul to all existing soul. Take what you need. I am present. This Evo and Lara, you help us so much creating uh, courses and uh, they're part of the Italian team and we see all the cups. Also, you can use uh, on animals. This is the future. So the future is really bright now. You can see lion and, and sheep getting together, no eating each other's. We're all living together in peace, like one family. Again, our wish. Do liberamente dalla mia anima a tutte le anime esistenti. Prendi quello che hai bisogno. Io sono presente. And here we see our future, very close future now, getting uh, together even with uh, the universal community. And here we see thanks to Cash, to Mr. Cash from uh, Italy. Yes, so I just translate a little bit, uh, summarize what I said before. Uh, what I said before was that um, I explained the video like um, I explained to you now, that um, we, we get together. We get together in uh, Italy um, and we make this video. Um, we get together to, to show the world what we, how we sustain uh, in, in these times, uh, Italy and uh, all, in the whole world, so all Italian people in all over the world. So we make teams, uh, we start to use Telegram and uh, do an emergency team, like uh, um, um, emergency of the, of the Cash Foundation. Um, and we did uh, this emergency team, not just in Italy, but all over the world, like, like you could see. Uh, to give support to, to anyone who was in difficulties for the corona or other things, not just the corona, 
for the corona, for, uh, for, for any other illness, for, because one cup, one life mean, mean what says in the chain. It means um, one cup, one life. So it means that uh, with uh, this cup, you can uh, create life and you can give lives and you can support life, lives. And it is the first time uh, ever that uh, everyone, housewife, electrician, um, student, children, elderly people, um, educated people, not educated people, farmer, everyone. It's the first time that everyone has been given for free knowledge, uh, very simple knowledge, very cheap knowledge, that if you got the stuff in your house, you actually cost you nearly zero, that you can do simply at home. So for the first time, everyone become a scientist in their own home with very low cost. And with this simple cup that you can do it in your home and everyone can teach to anyone simply and everyone can learn, um, we can make the change. We actually already made the change. So freely we can teach to, have been taught freely to, from us, from Mr. Cash, uh, from every Thursday, from YouTubes for the last maybe five years or more. I know actually Mr. Cash uh, um, since 2008. And since I met Mr. Cash and Mrs. Cash and, and I never saw them stop working. They're completely fully dedicating their life to serve humanity with one vision of peace in the world. And they teach freely from day one. And I saw them um, working, um, helping everyone as much as they can. And then I saw people uh, hear about them, not looking what they were doing. And these could be scientists, they could be astronauts, they could be uh, doctors, they could be politicians. They could be normal people uh, with no education. They're all getting together and start to see what uh, Mr. Cash and, and their family started in a very small, small town. Um, and, uh, and gradually all over the world start to go to see Cash for, for health, for other reason. And then slowly, slowly, they start to um, making the Cash Foundation because everyone just wanted to spread this knowledge, uh, this incredible knowledge, so simple, so incredible um, to everyone freely. We want vision, peace in the world, and where you are to serve. So gradually we, the Cash Foundation was formed. And in no time, I saw the Cash Foundation become worldwide. Everywhere in the world, there was Cash Foundation, Cash Foundation Italia, Cash Foundation China, Cash Foundation. So we all start to um, see this, this growing, massive growth exponentially everywhere in the world. And, and, and then I start to not see this uh, talk freely online because at the beginning, this knowledge was given to the government for free to every nation. And then was given to the scientist and to the doctor. So it's when the school was formed, physical school. And at the end was given freely to everyone. No one excluded in the entire earth and beyond. Um, and so we, we saw the beginning of this uh, um, uh, freely, um, just like YouTubes and Zoom and uh, um, you name it, um, Facebook. Again, to use the mass media to again teach freely to everyone. And now, a Thursday and Tuesday, everyone can go 
uh, even now, non-stop, every week for the last five years, everyone can come. New people, old students, uh, doctors, whatever, they can come and, and talk directly with uh, Mr. Cash every Thursday for making questions and learn the technology freely every Thursday, non-stop. And every Tuesday, like today, people can come all over the world and get united to get together and create a solution for a better world, for make the switch. Uh, everyone, no one excluded. Children, elderly people, women, and doesn't matter the nation, choose this one nation, one race to create peace in the world. Um, and so this is the beauty. So we learn for free, we teach for free. It's very simple, very cheap. Everyone can become a scientist now to make the switch. And the, the time is now. So, so the time is already started. So I thank you, all of you. I thank the Cash Foundation. I thank, I thank Mr. Cash uh, for saving my life, uh, const constantly giving me constant support. It was, it, when I was, uh, had the coronavirus and I, and I had uh, the symptom and I didn't know what to do, it was going really, really fast and really grow. Thanks God, I learned about the cash technology, and I think I called Mr. Cash, and uh, he was there, uh, really giving the full support to stop. It's the same, the Cash Foundation always been there, giving the full support. It's the same, the Italian team. Uh, I just, I just really, I don't, I don't have word to to my gratitude uh, for 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 this. So I'm very happy and I'm very pleased to be part of this, uh, this project, this, this, what we're doing now on Changing the World. So thank you so much. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you everyone for today's presentation. Thank you. Um, Rick, this is Jamila. So it was the last uh, presentation for the Nation Voice. So I give back the floor to uh, Carolina. Yes, hi. Thank you very much for the presentation from each Universal Council member. We work with one wish and we have been so successful with one wish that is we give freely from our soul to all souls in existence take what you need we are present the reason why is that we can picture whoever we need to be added to this wish but the beauty in reality also says that you are elevating your own souls, your soul and your physicality soul. And that is how we work together as a family. And thank you very much, Rick, for your presentation and your kindness. And I'm gonna hand it over to Jamila. Do you want to have something to say? Um, Mr. Topoli. Um, yes, Carolina, I um, actually I want to thank you all the members, Universal Council members for the great job they did for the time they uh, they give and for all the beautiful word and presentation they did. Thank you so much. And uh, we are, we are, we meet the point that we are one, interacting and working together. So we are ready, as we said, we are one, we have the structure and we are ready. So thank you, thank you very much, everyone. Thank you, Mr. Kesh, thank you, Knowledge Seekers, and thank you all the people who are there and uh, 
more will come from the voice of the nation and uh, more we come will will come from our uh, our interactions for the communities thank you very much <laughs> Thank you very much for the remembering and bringing forward all the achievements of the Universal Council. When I came here two weeks ago, it triggered the Universal Council and most of the Keshe Foundation knowledge secures to see what they've done, what have they progressed in. And as I said before, mankind has reached a turning point. And that turning point has come in a way when we established the Universal Council in two, three years ago, I said that they'll mature to the time. Maturity takes time. And in a way, what they've done in past week and this week, they have shown what a man can do. Now, from now on, we show the power of the creator. We show what we can deliver and we'll show how we'll change the course of humanity. And from then on, the Universal Council, the new life we, in a way, breathe into the Council will create a new dimension and a new dominion for them in so many ways that we let them mature, we led them through all sorts of conditions in the past three years to realize their power. And now we show them from master what can be done and how we move the whole structure of the humanity and in line with the universal community to a new dimension. When you listen to all these what we call historical time of past three years, what has been achieved. Up to now, they finished with the process of man. And from now on, we start the process of soul. We start the process of understanding the totality. We start with soul of the man to be elevated to understand the totality. And one of the cornerstones of this has been for that man stands to the point of understanding how, in a way, weak, word incompetent is wrong. Somebody is incompetent when, in, when he's taught what to do. Mankind has become too busy with the physicality, where they should have learned, they had a gorgeous opportunity that they can be in both, both in physicality and both in the universe. One of the works of the Keshe Foundation on the name of Keshe Foundation is the elevation of the soul of the man and the soul of physicality of the man to come to understand each other's beauty and work in a way, hand in hand. As we said, when we brought the soul of physicality some years ago, people could not understand. When we brought the soul of the man, it created more confusion. And now, we bring to the point where mankind will start to be, to do, and to live the way 
of what we call universe. As I said in the American teaching, the situation with the corona has brought to us that we see the government say, we let people loose, we cannot pay them, we cannot do anything with them. As we heard from the Maltese Universal Council and the private chats in the background, we let you out. So the only problem is if you die, you die. We cannot stop the society and the abuse we brought on you. Governments now open the door, everybody is free, free to die. Literally what it means, free to suffer. And this will come to the point that every being on this planet will be infected. And you will understand, man does not have the knowledge. Man does not have the comprehension how to overcome this virus. We battle it, as I said, like a kamikaze job, if we can get it, and we fight house to house, sniper by sniper, whoever gets shot, if you get picked up. Now we could see the snipers if you're in the alleys of Syria or Baghdad. This is a sniper we cannot see. It targets us and takes us to the point of destruction. And some of us will battle a bit longer with it, but we submit to it. And in this process, in so many ways, in so many ways, mankind does not have the knowledge. Mankind does not have the technology. And in that process, we have no choice. When we have earthquake, when we have disasters, in one nation, or one part of the country. As the same nationals and the same human race, we get into our rescue teams and we send flights and we send rescue operation to help. Because the people do not have the capability at that time to support themselves. They don't have the know-how, they don't have the facilities, all crushed, all destroyed. So the mankind has come to that point. You have an enemy inside you, which is going to take you one by one. The rate of the death in the coming months will be beyond the rate of the growth. And it will take everyone. Two choices we can give. We'll let you die. We'll let you one by one as human being, and then the animals, till an animal, a being, arrives that it can play the game as the virus. Or, as if you remember, if you go back to the time of 1980s, we had the Eastern Bloc and we had the West. And forever they were at each other's throat. It came a disaster at that time, very much like today. That disaster was called Chernobyl. We could not see inside because it was so closed inside. And when it started to affect all of us, the Russians opened the door and let everybody to come and help because it was beyond their control. And with that, a lot changed. 
a new understanding, a new culture of peace came to me. And we lost that battle of West and East and everything else, which were brainwashed since the Second World War. Now mankind has come to the same conjunction, the same point. This time is not a nuclear reactor. This time is not something that you can, as human, overcome. And this time we give man, the world leaders, those who are the leaders in religion, and those who think they are leaders of territories, one option. Lay down your arms, surrender to peace, and the universal community has the power and the knowledge to clean this planet. Game is very straightforward. We make one nation, one planet, one race out of the planet Earth. Or we'll let you take your course. We have watched you for thousands of years killing each other, and we'll watch you for under a few months to kill each other. By yourself. Or you surrender to our will and our wish. The universal community will clean up all the mess from jungles of Africa to South America to the North Pole to China and the rest on one condition total and absolute disarmament. Total and absolute disarmament. I do not teach this on Thursdays. Thursdays is a knowledge. Today is a one nation, one planet, one race. So we heard what humans done in past two weeks, and is your soul, as a member of Universal Councils, as the soul of human race, to blow the wind of peace to your leaders, be it religious or political, or whatever. In a way, if you remember, our motto of the Keshe Foundation is knowledge, science, and technology in exchange for peace. And this is the same from the Universal Council to humanity, not to nation by nation. Releasing the Earth from this mayhem, from this sniper, in exchange for surrendering to peace. And this will stay our ethos. You will meddle for another few weeks, in a few months, and more of you will die, and more of you will suffer, or we accept the total eradication, total closure of all industries, which brings death, pharmaceutical, vaccination, banking, and anything which brings misery to man. If we manage to run this planet without any wars, without any work, and we all stay peaceful, so it means we can carry on. We work to enjoy, we don't work to live. So as you know, I always talk a few weeks in advance, and a few months in advance, and mankind has been put a proposal on the table. Convince and raise the soul of your leaders to accept peace. Or we watch and we'll monitor you dying one by one as you've done for centuries, killing each other in mass. We have two choices. We'll let you 
to literally annihilate yourselves, then we don't have anything to do. We'll get a peaceful planet. Then we inhabit it by our ethos. And that is wrong. Or you change your ways and we welcome you to universal community our way. And that's very simple. My way. I explained this into the American Corona team on Sunday and we openly put it across to you on the YouTube and every other means you have we have opened our head. We don't need to do anything. We watch you for thousands of years killing, murdering, lying, cheating, deceiving. Now, doesn't go for your governments, that goes with all of you. As I said, some two weeks ago, around this time, we completed our cycle on this planet by the soul to be accepted. And now we move. We watch you. And it's the responsibility of you, those of the Universal Council who read so beautifully, now is your job to sing the song of the peace through your souls to your leaders and the rest of humanity. You have a spread across this planet. So, like those bottles of CO2 we saw with sellers in Caribbean, you can reach and create that dome to save this planet from the storms of what to come. And through that dome, extend it to universal community. Your job as the universal council members as of today has finished as a human race. And you move into a new dimension of using your souls. This is our wish, and we have never failed. The soul who will be the protector of humanity has arrived and has been accepted. And now it's time to bring peace and start the celebration. Celebration of new life, celebration of new cycle. And otherwise, all of your darlings, you can wait to be picked up by this time per corona. We have the knowledge. It's not that we don't want to help. We want to help. But you understand? Very simple. <clears throat> you have brought this disaster on yourselves. We never interfered before. Why should we interfere now? So it's very simple. Mankind surrenders to peace, total and absolute peace. Work the way the universal community works, to live with pleasure, not to live, to survive. Abolishment of all religions, abolishment of kingship, abolishment of leadership, abolishment of banking system, abolishment of the new, what you call pharmaceuticals, and the new disease called Gates vaccination. Oh, we let you die. And in one way, what we see, the temperature rises so much that none of you has a choice. Those who thought you walked away from the corona, you will die of cancer and every other disease within the next few months and years.
And do you know how we know? We have had it many times across the universe. And we have become an expert in how to change it. It's not the first time a planet has been invaded by viruses, by energy packs. So, in a way, we are well-trained rescue team. And we have every tools. But, it's very simple. We will not go in the fire when there's boxes of ammunition inside it that it can be dangerous. It can explode anytime. What we ask you, throw the ammunition out that we can see convinces that the world leaders signed to the Rule Peace Treaty and we deliver. I have the ones I love with me to deliver. The soul of mankind is too weak. And the physicality of it weak. So, the answer to past two weeks of listening and three weeks ago when I came here and I explained to you it's time to move in a way was to ask you to move your souls to elevate the others and as usual when somebody is given a team resigns what they have done we close shop because this is what we done and you gave your resume one by one but this is a resignation from the physicality and you have to rise to the soul of man. Next time we talk, in this level, there shall be no world leaders on this planet. Next time when we discuss, there will be no religious leaders on this planet. Next time I talk, will be peace. My way, my wish. Thank you. I am present. 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 As for the Universal Council presentation, I think we have presented everything today, Jamila. And I think we can close because we are within the four hours, as was requested to keep them between three and four hours maximum. So I thank the whole team, the Cash Foundation, the host, the co-host, the support members, the transcribers, translators, everyone as one family. We have a lot of work to do. It's time to be the souls to deliver. We see you tomorrow. Some in Rick's presentation, some in the private teachings, some in the language teachings. 
be happy, be joyful, enjoy. And I am present. See you next time. Thank you very much, Carolina. And thank you, Mr. Kesh. And of course, thanks to all of the Universal Council uh, members that have presented today. Lovely, beautiful presentation. And we thank everyone for being here and being present for it. This has been the 118th One Nation, One Planet, One Race for World Peace for Tuesday, May 19th, 2020. Thanks everyone. And um, as Carolina mentioned, there is the Cash Plasma Reactor Group uh, coming up Wednesday at 7 a.m. Central European time, as well as the other activities that are have been noted. Okay, we'll end now and uh, see you next time.